Hello viewers, how's it going? What is up? It's your boy. Oh, let me put my keyboard down. It's your boy, Super GT. And today, well, you know the drill. I don't know if you heard about this game. It's called um, Gran Turismo 7. Just came out. Um, I'm going to be playing that. I don't know if you know that. Um, yeah, we're going to jump in. We're going to try and complete stuff. It's this racing game on PlayStation. Um, for those of you who don't know what that is, it's like uh, it's a games console, and uh, so yeah, you try and drive the cars around the track as quickly as you can. You know. So we're going to do that today. And it's going to be pretty good fun, isn't it? Thank you, Andrew. Are you doing the Tside Twenty Four Hour Car Race in June? Uh, not plan. I haven't planned to do it at the moment, but could change. Who knows? Well, we were doing um, what were we doing? Circuit experience last night, and um, we got most of the way through it. But I think it's time just to complete that, get that done and dusted, and then uh, we can move swiftly on to more stuff, getting more and more done. So we did. Circuit experience of all the Americas, done, dusted. For those of you who watched yesterday, you would have seen absolutely 
insane rallying skills a fisherman's ranch done all of those europe we've done most of we've done brands goodwood le mans alsace nurburgring deep forest spa red bull ring dragon trail monza sardinia windmills have we done monza i think we did that near the end yes we have done it we have done it and yeah let's jump into oh we've done some of them let's jump into Maggiore. let's get this one done let's get through it shall we what car is it it's the alpha well, this is the very first thing i did in the game i did the first sector all righty how are we doing today everybody all good all good in the hood i hope you are oh my goodness let me turn now you want to see my my nice little socks here in fact look look at my little socks got numbers on them how amazing is that, that that's that's cool isn't it you don't see that every day Oh, wasn't even concentrating. Still got a gold. All the foot fetish people go wild in the chat. They're loving it. They're loving it. You sickos. You absolute sickos you are. Right, let's go. You are a bunch of sickos. Should be ashamed of yourself. Right. Going straight to wiki feet. Hey guys, vote me up on wiki feet. Any idea when the daily races will change? I guess every week. The wording was a bit weird for daily races, wasn't it? Because it says the daily races will be held, they will be held every day. It's like, okay, so they're available every day, but does that mean they'll change every day? I don't know. Why not? Why not change the name to weekly races if they're not actually daily anymore? Who knows? It's all a bit weird, isn't it? Right, sector five. Mm, 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 mm. Do you always start last in GT multi uh, single player? Um, it's, there's some races I've done where I was on a grid start, I wasn't last. So I don't think you always start last. But if it's one of those ones where, oh God, where you start really far back and you're like 30 seconds behind the leader, on those ones you start last. I think on a grid start you don't start last. But I don't know if that's like for everything this is the worst sector of all time this is if i get a gold here this would be like a 39 8 2 1 and it it shouldn't be a yeah Seven hundred thousand credits much um it's not nothing but it's not i would say it's much Can afford a decent enough car with it but you know you're not going to get too far with it thank you andy elliott and gp stinch can't hear the donation sound for some reason <laughs> my audio has been all over the place today all car stream mix system yes i don't know why it's not coming through then uh Can you hear the donation sounds? I don't know if you can. Maybe you can or you can't. I'm not sure. I know I can't. Oh no, wait. Should be able to now. This is muted on here. Right. I'm just an idiot. That's what's happened. Oh, we did that one. We've done Sainty Croix. There we go. We can hear it. 
You can hear it now. Mario Martinez. Thank you. Good sir. Hope you're doing well. No, you can't hear. But yeah, you should be able to now. Super GT of with expanded feet cam. That's the content the people want. Thank you, Nikki Nita, as well, for the 1141. Hello, Super GT viewer here. Just wanted to say thank you real quick for really getting me into sim racing. About to update for my old Logitech to a proper Fanatec setup. Man's going all out. Oh, no. Let's restart that. It's the Huracan. It's a bit slidey. I hated this car on GT Sport. So we're going to have to drive this one nice and delicately. Like this, okay? Um, yeah, like that. Missed the apex by about 10 miles, but... Come on, rotate. Okay, that was the worst sector. That would be a 24-4. See? Gotta go again. Bashdagger, how's it going, mate? Pretty sure you can claim the credits in the PS Store. Okay. I'll leave it for now. But if I ever get to a rainy day where I really need a million credits, I'll uh, cash them in. Okay, that's a lot better. It's a 23A. See? See how good I am at predicting the time. Next up, Sector 2. Oh, change gear there, bro. Oh, it's slidey. Oh, hello. Does anyone know how many menu books there are? There's 38, if I recall correctly. 38, 39, about that. It's not. It's less than 40. I think it's. I think it's 38, if I recall correctly. front end goes in, but then the back end just slides. Na, na, na. All right. Just three sectors. Okay. This is, this is going to be tricky in this car, this last sector. Can straight line this curb. Got to be careful with it though. Oh, no, not that one. A little bit too much. You need the sausage to be directly under your car in the middle. And I think that's the ideal line, but it's a tricky car to do it in. Thank you, Zach Malinowski. What a guy. Oh, that's really... Wow, that is really bad. Sarah is wearing a hat, says Zach. Thank you for that, Zach. Letting the people know the crucial information here. 
little bit deep. It's fine though, we'll recover that. Oh my god, the rear end is just... What's going on? Who did the setup on this car? Jesus. Wow, okay. Thank you, Eagle. How's your day so far? Yeah, it's been really nice actually. It's been a very good day. It's been a very good day. Ah, uh, it's not much better. Wow, okay. This This car is very tricky. I did I did think this last act would be hard. Hey Arkies, how you doing man? Good to see ya. Just a little bit of improvement and we'll be fine. Nice and gentle, there you go. Caress the car around the corners. Yep. <sighs> okay, only just, but... Thank you, Red Dead. Red Dead Daniil, first member of the stream. Thank you very much. Right, one lap attack, let's do it. And thank you Cody Gibson, back for more stream content king. This time not while working. Also I heard you love driving Lambos in this game. Well, not on this evidence, mate. This Lambo especially is not not particularly easy. Like it turns in and then the back end just wants to go round all the freaking time. Thank you, Sonder Holt, for the donation, mate. Well, that's a bit too late on the brakes. Let's continue. It's a 147.2 to beat. On the power, onto the middle straight. Looking for the break in the tyres just before the 100 board. There, hard to spot, but it is there. Into the apex. Upshift early, and again. Keep the car under control, don't let it oversteer. Look for the outside, power to the outside. Break in a straight line, coast the car in, and then dance it over the kerbs. Oh no, missed it. Power out to the yellow. Oh my god. Alright, we did it. Just say my two year badge. Damn time time flies. Sonder Holt. Man, yeah. It is crazy, isn't it, when people have been members for more than two years on this channel. It's very cool to see. More than three years in some cases. Even four years, I think, some people. It's a mad it's a mad thing, mate. <laughs> Right, that's another one done. Done that, done that, done... Just... 
I think it's just road course now. I think it's just this one. And then we're done. In Europe. It's broken! It's broken! Ooh, Audi R18 for this, okay. Thank you to Dodi Signolo. Hi Super GT, love your content. Many others are doing videos on GT7, but this is where everyone should be. Don't you know it, mate? That's an absolute fact. Don't you know it? I'm glad you have realized the truth. You've joined the religion of Super GT. Oh my, not this again. Why are LMP1 cars or Group 1 cars so strong on the wheel? Let's turn this force feedback down. That's ridiculous. Right, okay. It just suddenly starts going like this. What the hell? Right, okay. Don't go mental. TCS on? No. A bit late. Okay, that was rubbish. Let's continue. I think a tip I would give for these and the licenses is always good just to finish, and then you have a ghost. I think it's easy to race. I think it's better to have a ghost to race against. Because you can see where you're losing your time. Oh, there. Okay, we lost loads through turn one. I can definitely take this corner a lot better. Yeah. Easy. See? Easy. Which is why we only got a silver. <laughs> Thank you, Speed Minion. What's up from Las Vegas? Just finished B license. Whoa. In Vegas, mate. Love that. Let's get a better exit. Get out of here. Wasn't going to be quicker. Okay, let me turn the full sweep back, back up a little bit. Right, stop going mental, stupid wheel. Maybe keep it in second. Should be good enough. Ooh, close. Thank you, Red Dead Daniel, again. I was pulling out my hairs getting golden all license with the PS4 controller. They are pretty tricky, some of them. But like, they're not easy. Thank you, Troy. He's Pex Chest. Yes, I think so. Sadoon Oza. I made a 60s or 70s Corvette 660pp. I think it's somewhat drivable, but it's definitely fast. I need to get some, yeah, I need to start tuning a couple of cars and doing some online races. I haven't really done any online yet. I've done a little bit. I need to get some tuning done. I'm looking back. There's no one there. Okay. Right. That was shocking. Apple guy with the five. I've been stuck on license S10 for three hours now. I need your blessings. S10 is really hard. 
very hard. Yeah, S10 is a proper challenge. Let me tell you. Oh, it doesn't want to go in that fifth gear. Rev is very low. Still not good enough. If this one, yeah, uh, I think this car, I just find it a little bit tricky to drive. Yeah, TC is off. Okay, that's a lot better. Once you just get the feel of the car, you can just, you can learn how much you can lean on it in the corners. And obviously that was a good amount there. It was absolutely beautiful, if I may say so myself. Yeah. No sweat, mate. No sweat. Sector four now. Look at that. I'm faster than Mikhail Hizal. You, see, you can see that, right? I'm better than Mikhail Hizal. It's official. It's official now. I've made it. All right. We've got the fast sweeping left hander over the brow of the hill and then the final hairpin. Can we do this flat? Let's try it. Yes, we can. 100 board. Ooh, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. Flat out through here, no problem. And then drive straight to the line for the shortest distance. And it's a gold first time. Lovely stuff. Lewis Ashford. Thank you for the donation, mate. What are your thoughts on multiplayer? Um, it's, multiplayer's a bit weird at the moment because there's only two races. I... It seems weird that they haven't, like, hit the ground running with the multiplayer and there's no FIA races to do. You would have thought that, oh, it's the launch of the game. Let's actually make a championship that people can actually enter. It's like they've just kind of gone, uh, there's some daily races. There's two. Just do those. Um, I like the multiplayer. I've had some good races. I don't mind the tuning, but I can understand that people don't want to spend the time tuning. Because that, that, that was a strength of GT Sport that you could just... You can jump on, oh, I just want to do a race today. And you don't have to worry about tuning and all of that. But I will get on to multiplayer a lot more. Um, I, just want, I want to get through a lot of the single player as well. Maybe on Monday. Uh, let's see if it's like weekly races. Maybe they'll change on Monday, and then I'll do a live stream on Monday doing the new races. But yeah, we'll have to see what they do. And of course, as well, when the first FIA season comes up, we'll uh, stream that. Release the brake a little bit early. Sometimes you have to really hold the brake into the apex. Uh, let go a bit too soon there. All right, let's see. 27, 28, 29, 30. Yep. Get in there, Lewis. Fantastic drive, mate. You are the world champion, mate. All right, let's move on. Thank you, Gianluca Carfora, for the super chat. Thank you, TS12, broke student, but love you long time. Don't you love to hear that? 
I'm making students spend their last one dollar on me. It's just incredible, isn't it? Thank you to Dodi Signolo for becoming a channel member. What a guy. Absolute legend. Thank you very much. Okay, I think, let me just double check, but I think that is all of Europe done. Thank you, Mike V. That's that done. What are your go-to favourite cars in each class, or does it really depend on the situation? I've, pff, hard to say. I mean, there aren't really classes at the moment. It's just like, PP rating must be below this, or below this. If you mean like Group 3, the Porsche, 911, RSR. Group 4, haven't really played it enough. I've only driven the Supra in Group 4. So I haven't really played enough different cars. But I think the Porsche is a very solid bet in Group 3. Done that. Maggior. Done. Catalonia we did. St. Croix we did yesterday. Did this, yeah. Alsace. Yeah. Nürburgring, I remember doing this. Yeah. Spa Francochon. We have done that. Goodwood. Yes. And Brands Hatch, I'm pretty sure I did that. Yes. Uh, just double check this one. Yep. Okay. So we have now done Americas and Europe in circuit experience. That is. Would you look at that? 69% circuit experience now done 31 percent remaining which all resides in asia oceania let's do it autopolis first i hate this track such a boring track dragon trail pretty sure i did dragon trail if not we'll come back to it thank you a man pf thank you chemical 54 can you say get in there, Lewis, in a Jamaican accent? Oh my god, here we go. Get in there. <laughs> get in there, Lewis. That's going to need some refinement, isn't it? That's, that was embarrassing. I won't do that again. I won't ever do that again. Oh, the GTR Nismo. Group 2 around Autopolis. embarrassing Jamaican accent. Get in there, Lewis, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> Ooh, all right. Don't ever do that again. Don't you ever say that in that accent ever again, mate. Oh, my God, it's understeer. What is that all about? Yeah, at least I tried, you know. I'm putting my reputation on the line here by giving that accent a go, but I do apologise for any Jamaicans who I've just massively disrespected by by shamefully replicating your accent. What? Why is there no grip? This should be a very grippy car. You did well. Thank you, Chemical. I'm glad you think so. And thank you, Icy. Wish there was an easier way to see track EXP. Oh my god. These cars are really not very grippy. Opinion on Latifi beating Albon easily. If he beats him, it won't be easily. So I don't think that will happen. All right. There is the gold uh, medal. Uh, that's my horrific French accent. Grip is less than GT. Yeah, grip is definitely less than GT Sport. Hundred percent. Well, it's there, but I don't know. I think you just have to be like super precise and it's there but if you're if you go slightly above the limit it's it's not there
Nothing happened. Ooh, that was close, but we did it. Okay. Moving on. Sector three. Na 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 na. Right, let's go. Thank you, M Ray. Can you please pause and say this for my crush? Remzi. Is that how you say the name? M Ray likes you so much, but he's so nervous around you. Would you talk with him? No, mate. You got you got to do this yourself. You got to do this yourself. You got to pluck up the courage, mate. If you have to ask, it's game over already. You do it or you don't do it. That's my advice. We believe in you. We believe in you, good sir. You can do it. All right, let's get this freaking gold. This is actually quite tricky. The grip is so like low. Like I think it's too low. These cars are not like this slidey. They should be grippy. Let me turn this force feedback back up a little bit because we're not in an LMP1 car anymore. Thank you, LT. Cheers from the US. Enjoying the content. Keep it up and I'll see you on the track. What a lovely message. Thank you very much, man. Hope you're enjoying the stream. Thanks for tuning in. Okay. Oh my god, a bit wide. Wow, I'm really making a hash of this. This is not easy. I remember Key25 said, um, was it yesterday? Or the day before? He popped into the into the chat and he was like, yeah, try a Suzuka in the Group 2 car. So I think that's going to be difficult. I mean, this is proven to be pretty hard, actually. These cars just don't have much grip. They do, but... It's just very easy to break the grip. If you know what I mean. Okay. That should be it. 39.9. I shall take the Zat. No, no, no. Thank you, Dylan. Advice on the super challenge for Group B license. Is that is that the final? I think that's the final one around this track, isn't it? It's like a couple of the corners. Yeah, that car's very slidey. I mean, I think you have to really... You don't want to miss the apex. Really get on the brake at the right time. Get as close to the apex as possible. Let the car pivot on the apex and then drive off. It's really easy to be over eager on the brakes on that Supra. Just make sure you don't overcook the corner on the way in. So sometimes a little bit less is less is more, if you know what I mean. Like you try and attack it too much and then you actually end up losing. wheel it's very wide
Oh, God. Almost touching the grass there. How's it going? Keep smashing it, Steve. Steve-o, Super GT for the win. Don't you know it, Brad? Don't you, don't you know it? Super GT for the win. I agree. You know what? I, in my completely unbiased opinion, like I completely agree. Right, Suzuka then. This is it. The key. The Oracle. Key 25 warned us, foretold us about the difficulty of the fabled Suzuka circuit in the Group 2 Nissan Nissan Honda NSX Concept GT. And hereby we must attempt this perilous journey around this highly dangerous combination of car and circuit. We are to get gold on all of them. Oh, it feels a bit sketchy. Oh, yeah, it feels really nervous. Doesn't want to go in. Whoa, hello. Say hello to my little friend called Oversteer. Oh, no. Gold, mate. Like, yeah. Easy. No sweat, mate. Thank you, Chance. Kaufman. Stole my... Stole my mum's card so I can say hi to you. Love that. Chance is uh, mum, if you're watching. Um, your son or daughter is uh, stealing your card, so you might want to discipline them. This is unacceptable behavior thank you Caden N as well hi Steve can you please add more max radio comms to the donation sounds okay I'll uh, have to have a look what's, what's uh, some other good uh, max for staff and uh, radio messages stay hydrated sanitize as well please sanitize The giant lizard on the track. See you later. Oh, the one, one of my favourite ones he did last year was uh, it was at Interlagos when they said to him, um, it, "What was it? Oh, Max, uh, you've got a black and white black and white flag or warning." And he's like, what "Was it? What did he say? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, cheers. Whatever. Say hi. Something like that." He just dismissed it. Didn't he? Just didn't care. Yeah, nice. Say hi. I actually found that pretty funny, to be fair. Oh, it's just a hairpin. Yeah, I went in a bit slow. Could definitely go in a bit harder there. Yeah, perfect. Say hi. That was it. Yeah. So, yeah, whatever. I just don't care, mate. I didn't ask, mate. Ratio. Oh, no, that was rubbish. Let's do that again. Definitely breaking a bit too early. Max Verstappen ratioing the stewards mid-race. I mean, multi-talented or what? Going a bit wider. Oh, get wrecked, ghost. Get wrecked, son. Bottom of the friend's leaderboard, but I don't care. It's gold. Okay, next up, Spoon Corner. Who doesn't love a bit of Spoon? 
we all love a bit of spoon, don't we? And if you don't, well, you you do deep down. So stop lying to me. Thank you, Jan. Or Jan. Hey, man, plans for this season of karting? I'm not sure yet. Trying to work it out. But I will be doing some. I will be karting. I will be racing. Don't you worry. I'm, I know why I'm doing this month. I'm doing a charity event at Wilton Mill later in the month. Um, I'm also going to be doing Buckmore Park 24 hour. And I'm with Jimmy. We're on a team together with some other guys. And it, that'll be really good fun. So I'll make a video of that. Um, so I did the 24 hour a couple of years ago with WTF1. We was with Jimmy, Matt Gallagher. Who else did we have? James Baldwin. Tommy, WTF1. Oh, get in there, mate. This wasn't that hard. I don't know what key 25 is saying here, but look at that, top of the leaderboard. That's like, you just, you just witnessed greatness. <laughs> you just saw perfection. Best lap of all time, that was. Okay, full lap. Let's do it. What's the time? 152.1 to beat. Jesus Christ. Hey, okay, that feels all right so far. wide there but get on the power it's all right first half of spoon was good second half a bit wide should be able to go flat around 130r quite easily and then break about 125 meters before the corner steer it in keep to the right around here Slightly shorter run to the line. Oh, mate. This is easy. What are you on about? The one bang. We just threw in the one bang. We don't need a second attempt. We don't need no second attempt. Suzuka, see you later. Who needs no second attempt? I mean, come on. We don't do second attempts here. lap of the gods i had a outer body experience like senna at monaco in 88 that's what you just saw then i wasn't fully in control then that was just my my spirit just controlling the car it was like from another dimension honestly i was just that's one in a one time in a century that happens incredible stuff it was powerful i really felt that and i hope you did too what car is it? Oh, it's another Group 2 car. They do like the Group 2 cars at, at, in Japan. Where are we breaking? 100. No, we are not. 
We do need a second attempt. 125. 125 before this corner. 200, 150, there. Still a bit deep. Uh, still a gold. Thank you, Shmojo, uh, Smojodzi. Godzilla size PP status. <laughs> Don't you know it? Nicky needs to send it from Max on Imola. Oh, what am I doing? Go back to sector two. Thank you, Skim, SKZM for becoming a member, and Chris for becoming a member as well. Cheers, guys. All right. me okay another one super gt driving a super gt super gt section okay final sector quite a difficult final sector here at fuji never been the biggest fan break just under the shadow Probably could have braked a tiny bit later. Straight line that. Bit wide. Seven eight to B. Six seven. Okay, cool. Smashing through it. Smashing through one lap attack. Let's go. Let let us dance around a Fuji. What was my brake bias? Three. Mm, leave it back a little bit. Right, where are we going? There. I knew that slide was coming. Right, let's break just under the shadow. Oh no, that wasn't a very good line. in a bit early for that final corner it's such a weird corner you can take there's like so many different lines you can take 33 4 to beat here's the line 32 1 fantastic absolutely fantastic done it guys that is fuji defeated Thank you, Togua P Potobo. I hope I said that right. How do the license tests feel? Too easy? Just say you smash that gold time, no problem. Um, for me, mo like the vast majority of them get gold. I've got gold first or second try. There are a couple which like catch you out, especially the final one. Two million credits. 
Uh, S10 is very difficult. Um, there's a couple here and there which are like pretty tricky. Most of S is not too bad. S10 was pr pretty hard. Thank you, Sussy Backer. My favorite Mac sound clip is so basically I'm going to fully send it. I have to try and search for that one. Thank you, Mark Rivas, the man, the myth, the legend. Caught live, love your content. Thank you very much, Mark. Thank you, Laksh Plays, for the super chat. Broad Bean, we did this yesterday, I think. Correct. How about Kyoto? Have we done this? No. Yamagiwa. Jump in. Please don't give, give me a group three car. There we go, the Lancer. Why aren't you replacing Mazepin? I know, it's a joke, isn't it? I can't believe Gene Haas hasn't been watching my live stream and uh, decided to for me to replace Mazepin. It's a joke, isn't it? See, like, with talent like that, why would he overlook me? Plus, I'd finish sixth in every race. For a Haas, that's pretty good. So, why would he not want that? Oh, that's really wide. Why would he not want a sixth place finish? It's guaranteed every race. Hmm, yeah, I went way too wide on the first corner. Nice. Sector one ticked off. Give me sector two now. Mm -hmm. A long left hander. Eh? I mean, this track does have lots of l lots of long corners. Turning right into a left hander. Good one. Do the chicane as well. Not the Kyoto chicane. Hate this thing. Oh god, that's a lot of understeer. I'm not gonna mess. Let's see if I can recover this. Nope. <laughs> I thought that was a bit too hot. Yeah, maybe about 10 meters before the curb is where I need to break. That's a bit wide. Late apex. Can abuse the chicane again. Okay, we have the gold. Thank you, the Burbal Podcast for the ten seventy four. Love your content, mate. If you ever want to get yourself to Bathurst. For the 12 hour, you're welcome to stay with us here. We'd love to see you smash around Mount Panorama. Well, that is a very nice offer, and thank you. I, I would like to go. I've never been to Australia. Um, so, you know, one day, hopefully I'll see you there, mate. In Australia, mate. This is the live stream of horrific accents, isn't it? For those who've just tuned in, I did a horrific Jamaican one, and no, I'm not going to do it again. Oh, not a good exit. One, yeah, come on, get in there, Lewis. Fantastic sector, mate. 
Okay, one lap. String it all together. Ooh, SH has donated. Thank you, SH. Right. Take that flat if you get the line right. That was decent. Right, let's remember where to break here, just a bit before the curb. Steer it in. much curb oh. okay I think that was a decent lap there we go yep 1.7 seconds quicker I will take that I will take that indeed all right flying through it mate Oh, no, don't want to do it again. We are done there, guys. On to the next one, which is... Miyabi. It is indeed. Three sectors for this track. No, two sectors plus the one lap. In the Audi TT, we've whipped the titty out. Let's do it. Come on, turn. That was way too late on the power. Oh, gosh. A bit wide. Okay, that's all good. Fantastic. Game of muscle in the chat. What are you doing here? Game of muscle. How many cars do I have? Uh, oh, I don't know. About 60? Approximately. I don't really know. Straight line the hell out of that. Oh, it wasn't enough. Seven thousandths of a second. Mm, 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 mm. Let's just beat the ghost and we should get it. Yes, easy, mate. Oh, might have shifted up there. You cleared the gold level for this sector. Amazing work. Congratulations. Thank you, Sarah. No need for the weird voice, though, is there? All right, next one. Mm -mm. One lap attack around Kyoto Miyabi. This is it. The lap of the gods. Freshly served by Super GT. Oh, it's beautiful. It's just... It was pure driving. I'm going to come back for that late apex. Minimise the distance travelled. Cut the chicane. Straight line the exit. And head straight to the line. It's going to be a 40.721. Oh, my God. Pretty close, actually. I'll take that. Uh, 
All right. Oh, God, not gone it again. Miyabi next. No, we just done that Miyabi. Um, what is next? Togo Expressway. Broad Bean, Sakuba, Togo, Dun Fuji. Togo Expressway. How many different? Oh, okay. So this is. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, why? Why do you have to do this to me? Why must you do this to me? Game. In the WRX Group 3 car. Yeah, guys, hit the like button if you are enjoying. Get yourself subscribed as well. If you're not already. If you uh, want to watch more of this. Oh, the force feedback goes really weird. Yep, that was always going to result in failure. Thank you, Obdure, Obdure. And that one chicken as well. Oh, keep that in the track limits there, son. Hint of a lift. 22 2 to beat. There's the line. Yeah, no sweat, mate. Does this game feel significantly different to GTS? I'm waiting to get home to play. Such is the life of a trucker. Airstrike if you get this first try. It was first try, that one. So, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll airstrike. Yeah, nice. Boom. Um, it's definitely different than GT Sport. Definitely. Like, massively different. It's more sensitive, it's more lively. Cars are all over the place. You have to be a bit more precise. Quite a lot more precise, actually. The Burble Podcast has become a member. Thank you, The Burble Podcast. Cheers, guys. Thank you. Love that. And I'll remember your offer should I ever find myself at Mount Panorama one day. Uh, you can't take it that quick. It's a good apex, but it's way too fast. <sighs> okay, I'm trying too hard here. This is a bit silly. Come on, sort your life out. Sort your life out, mate. Take this corner properly. Okay, right. Stop being an idiot. I'm just trying way too hard to be perfect. Right, that'll do. That will have to do. I was off the power for about eight years there, mid-apex, but it's gold, so we move on. Whoa, Noni's Bar. Thank you for the 866. I do appreciate that. The thousand yen donation. That's 1,000 yen. Oh, no. <laughs> you should break for that corner. Can I put rear bias? Yeah. Give me some rotation up in the house, please. Oh, that's hard to see. No, not good enough. Only bronze. Olympic time trials, PTSD. Oh, mate, don't you know it? We'll get to the south in uh, south inner loop in a minute. And yeah, I will have severe PTSD, mate. I don't lift through this bit. Yeah, that's a bit better. Oh, easy. It's like a 19.7. See? Sector four. Mm -mm. And thank you, uh, Martius, Mar Martius Tardissimus, for becoming a member as well. What a guy. Oh, no. Wow, why has this car got such awful brakes? I mean, yes, I'm braking too late, but... I would have thought they'd be better than this. I thought 
thought I'd just be brave there. It wasn't the right call. Okay. Did exactly the same thing. Is this the licenses? No. This is circuit experience. So every track is divided up into sectors and you have to get a certain amount of time through each sector. And then there's one for the whole track as well. So this is a separate mode than the, the licenses. 169. Yeah. Lovely. Fantastic. Right. One lap attack. Let's do it. Thank you, Konstantinos and Derek Morrison as well. Both of you, massive thank you. Okay, that was a bit better through there. What steering wheel am I using? Um, the Fanatec DD1 for PS4. All the equipment I'm using is linked in the description if you want to take a look. But yeah, the rim is the McLaren GT3 V2 by Fanatec. Compa uh, compatible with PC and PlayStation and Xbox actually oh, play it nice and safe there that's very wide but we'll go with it there we go Constantino says hi from the GVR esports from Greece thank you very much mate Hope everything is well. Oh, okay. That is one of the many Tokyos complete. So many Tokyo tracks. Are they making me do all the reverse ones as well? You live in Kyoto. So exciting. That's really cool. You should uh, make a petition to make the track real. Central counter. Oh, you have to do the other versions. Clockwise, counterclockwise. Oh. All right. BMW Z4 GT3. Thank you, Louis Hempel. Or Louis Hempel. Love the content. Keep doing what you are doing. I will do that. I will do that just for you, good sir. Thank you, JS46designs, for becoming a member. All right, Tokyo Expressway. Here we go. Where do we break? 150, I reckon. No, that was way too early. But right, we're going to run with it. Right, we can break it a little bit later than that. What about a oh, good break at the hundred board? Yeah, easy. Because it's uphill. We can break later. Okay, that's only just a gold, but it's enough. Felt very understeery. That did. We go again. Mm, 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 mm. This has been my screen all evening. Well, I'm happy to keep you company. The chicane is quite tricky. Get very close to the wall. Power through it. Don't hit the other wall. Back over to the left under the bridge. Turn in. Bit of a lift to get the nose in. Back on the power. Back to the right turn before the crest back on the power it's blind but you have to be brave look towards the 50 board break on it turn in back on the power back to the right 
and then on the power before you can see the exit and it's a not good enough i thought that was pretty tidy half a second off it's huge ass high speed ring next please good old high speed ring we'll get to high speed ring very soon my friend huge ass Oh, Noah with a big $50. Thank you very much, man. That is uh, extremely generous of you. Oh, that was a... Do this track with the SRT Tomahawk v... X VGT. It's great fun. I can imagine... You could probably do... like Apart from the hairpin and the first two corners, you could probably do it all flat. Which is quite a frightening prospect. Car's actually more grippy than you think. That was only still just about gold. Like that's, that car's actually pretty grippy mid corner. When you really push it. Thank you again, Noah. That was very uh, nice of you, mate. I uh, hope you're having a great day. Right, sector three. This is just the hairpin. Can we just cut across there? Okay, nice. First time. Mm -mm, rough ideas until Bathurst. Well, we're getting, we've only got a few more tracks to do, but Tokyo will take a little bit because there's four more, four other configurations I have to get through. But it won't be too long. Have you done Chicane of Death? Yes, so I've done all of the Americas and all of Europe now. We are finishing off uh, Asia, Oceania. Oceania. However you say it. Thank you, Carlos Fernandez, for the four ninety nine. Cheers, bro. Carried more speed there, but it's not, it's not too bad. Oh, this is actually a very fun couple of corners there. Okay, this feels all right. Feels good. Okay, that, that felt good to me. If this ain't gold, then might as well just give up and go home, even though I'm already at home. There we go. I think out of all the, the sectors and then the one-lap attack, the one-lap attack tends to be easier. I find, anyway. The gold time 
obviously it's harder to avoid hitting the wall for a, a whole lap, but if you can get to the finish, then I think target time's easier. Whoa, hello, um, Carlos. Is it true Argentinian? That is incorrect. I am part Filipino, but from England. Lackland, Sutherland. Thank you, Nathan Bibby. Thank you, Precious. Thank you, Noah, again. Um, Precious says, thank you so much for your videos. You made me want to play the game again after so many years. The least I can do is give, uh, give you that, even if it's not much. Mate, just the message is uh, an honour. Thank you very much. Oh, we saw some here to do. South clockwise. Oh, no, not this track. The stupid chicane. Most stupid chicane in Gran Turismo. It is stupid. It's right there, guys. I can't... Wait, maybe... You can, where do I have to point? Like there. You can just about see it on the, on the map. There. That chicane there is stupid. Hate it. Who invented it? Um, what are the big, biggest differences between GT Sport and GT7? The handling is very different. It's much more lively on this game. Much more lively. I haven't tried the Tomahawk with my steering wheel yet. Just a little scared. Yeah, you probably want to turn, turn your force feedback down because it is a bit ropey. You'll probably snap your arm off. Okay. Tokyo. Let's go. Okay, that, that was horrific, but... Forty-two. We've got to do the hairpin then. Look for the one fifty. Mm, too early. Definitely too early. Okay. That yeah could easily go three quarters of a second quicker than that. Next one. Scarecrow with a five. Been watching you for a while. Just here to show some love before I hop back on GT7. Scarecrow, thank you very much. Um, glad you're enjoying the content. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for the donation, mate. Have a good day. Have yourself a fantastic day, Scarecrow. Standing in a field, scaring off all the birds. Have yourself an amazing day. Is that it? What's the point of that? It's driving in a straight line. Flat out. It's not straight, but it's flat. Okay. That's kind of that's kind of a weird challenge. I do think they've missed a trick by not having like they only have a friends leaderboard. They should have a global leaderboard, I think. In fact, they really should. They really should. Have I done all the licenses? Yes, I have done all the licenses. All gold. Right, here's the stupid chicane. Worst thing in existence. I don't know, I haven't even driven on this game yet though. Hmm. Okay, it wasn't too bad, but it's still stupid. Reaper with a five dollar donation. Cheers from the US. Wish this came on PC, but oh well, your gameplay is fun to watch regardless. Thank you, Reaper. Appreciate that, mate. Right, one lap attack around Tokyo configuration 412.6. I can't remember the name of it. South in a loop something right I can break a little bit later than 150 here maybe 125 
come back for a late apex. Look at that. Beautiful. Right, this bit's flat. Hard. There is a little bit of hard difficulty here, though. When you go into the tunnel, it's actually quite hard to see exactly where you're going. And I found that I've struggled to ad adapt my eyes going in and out of tunnels. Like there, it's just for a brief second. And here, a bit tricky. Uh, okay, not on the power early enough there. Chicane. Play it safe. I think I'm on a good lap. Don't need to risk it. And to the line we go. Where's the man with the flag? There he is. 32.8. That was a good lap, I think. It wasn't too bad. Room for improvement, but I'll take it. We move swiftly on to another variation of Tokyo. 2.2 million, man. I am rich. Shame I can spend all of that in like one second on one car. Um, thank you, Wilma. Wilma Dickfit. Ha ha ha. Thank you. Nils for the donation. And thank you, Noah, again. Why do you use USD instead of Euros? Um, I think it's something to do with stream elements. It just, every donation comes up as USD. I don't, I need to look at it, why it does that. I don't know. But um, yeah, not sure exactly, to be honest. Right, well, we're back in the Subaru WRX, the understeery, horrific brakes car. Right, what is this corner? I don't know where I'm going here. Oh, is this track? Yeah, I know this one. I know this one. Vindicate 86, thank you for the 1576 or this 20 Canadian dollars. Thanks for all the good content, buddy. Cheers from Canada. Thank you, Vindicate. You are the real OG, my friend. You are the, the proper gangster that I wish I was. I'm not. You go flat. Oh, okay. You can take that bit flat. You get the line right. That is flat. Requires some bravery and commitment. Take a late apex. Oh, no. oh, skimmed it right. Commit a little bit later. Darth Voda. What a name. Thank you for the donation, my friend. <laughs> oh, I'm going to lift. I'm going to lift. It's not worth it, mate. It's not worth it. Where do I turn in? Oh, that corner's more open than I thought. Oh, get out of here, mate. 22, 2.01. One thousandth of a second. Although, wait, do you part? If I got, if you get dead on the time, does that count or not? I don't know. All right, commit late, commit late, commit late. It's about the same. Mm, all right. I want to do this flat. I know I can do it flat. Commit late, commit late, commit late. Not that freaking late, you idiot. Thank you, Wender. Big fan here. Horse feedbacks, it's pretty sharp. It's just the physics are like very crazy. Oh, 
I skimmed the wall. Okay, that's good. Ooh, that was quite a good little run, that. Like you know her again. And Phil McCrack. That's an order. Thanks for the content, my friend. Thank you for the interesting names, my friend. Thank you, Wenda. How's force feedback going on in GT7? Yeah, it's, um, I think it's good. But it's hard, like, I'm going to be biased because I'm using a DD1 Fanatec. So maybe I need to whip out like a CSL Elite and see what it's like on that. Thank you, Noah, as well. What a hero you are. Right, there's a fast sweep over the top of the hill. Oh, mate, have you ever seen it taken that perfectly before? I don't think you have. I do not think you have. Thank you, Damon. Wish this game would have BOP online races. It's the only thing stopping me playing, uh, paying 80 bucks. Keep up the good work. Uh, keep up the work, long time viewer. Thank you, Damon. Yeah, I, I, I think we'll have the FIA championships, which will be BOP. But it looks like a lot of the um, champ, uh, daily races won't be. I don't know where I'm going. That was going to be a horrific collision. Thank you, Pete. Okay. I don't know how sharp these corners are. All right, I'll do. Pete, 89. Thank you for the donation. Okay, that's quite a tricky. It's really hard to judge those corners. All right, this one, stay on the outside, stay on the outside, stay on the outside, and then, okay, all right. Thank you, Mike V for becoming a member. Wills, Bills for a donation as well. Right, stay outside, stay outside, and then cut back for that late apex into the wall. Yeah, the force feedback's all over the place on these bumps. It feels really, it's off. It's off. Doesn't feel right. God's sake. Cole Ramsey, Noah Dawn. Thanks for becoming members. And Lewis Hemp. I can't read your name, sorry. Lewis for the donation as well. Get in there, Lewis. Oh, for f God's sake. What's your favourite car to drive so far? Probably, I really like driving the Alpha 155. I would say it's the easiest car to drive, but it's one of my favourites. I like driving it. Yeah, that'll be it. <sighs> okay, that's that's quite a hard little sector, that. And the hard thing is, on the one lap attack, that's going to be the last sector. But uh, let's do it. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, wait, one sec, sorry. Maybe you need to... Get in there, Lewis. Miracles do happen, mate. Let's just try that on five. I'll try that on five a little bit. So the one of the force feedback settings we might let's just try it a little bit lower yeah so the detail from the road like so around tokyo you get all the there's little bumps in the road 
and I can feel them less now, which is a good thing because they're quite annoying. Oh my god, right. Come on, that's stupid. Can you please enter a name? It's too wide. That was really slow. That was very slow. But well, we are going to continue. I think you know her again. Right, where am I going here? It's the long left that tightens up slightly at the end. And then the tighter left. Mm, I was very hesitant. <laughs> Two tenths. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I was very hesitant on that lap. I can I can definitely improve that. Are you going to do 200 lap Le Mans race on GT7? Oh, I haven't thought that far ahead, but maybe. Right, okay. We, we, we got this. It's a bit of rear bias. Get out of here. Oh my god, man. It's so frustrating. These Tokyo tracks, because of the walls. Slash my driving. I just wonder if that corner is actually flat. It's really hard to judge the turning point. Right, okay, this feels all right so far. We're a long way ahead of the ghost. Play it safe. Bring it home. No need to push. Get the gold. Okay. Nice. That's, that's a sketchy lap, that. Quite hard to get right. Good fun. It's good fun. We've done half of Tokyo. Is that half of Tokyo? No. That's four sixths of Tokyo. Mm, 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 mm. Am I the only one who thinks TCS is too OP in GT7? I don't know. I think I think it's still quicker with it off. I think it's still quicker with it off. Oh, we've got to go around this track backwards. Okay. All right. Thank you, Matt, for tipping 10. Cheers from Seattle. Good old Seattle. Who, who, who wants to bring back the Seattle track? I should definitely bring back the Seattle circuit. Right, where am I breaking?
God, I went deeper than the Mariana Trench there. Still got a gold though, so... Surprise! Stop donate to this guy. Don't you know it? Hey, Jimmy's in the chat. I know, mate. I'm I'm washed, mate. Did you know that, Jimmy, that I'm washed? I'm not number one on all of the licenses. So, I'm washed. I'm done. Game over. I might as well just give up. Now I think the force feedback is too low. If anything. Oh, that was probably the worst corner of all time. If this is gold, then something's wrong. Something's very wrong. I can't remember these corners. Well, that was pretty well judged, actually. Okay, yeah, it wasn't gold, ultimately. Yeah, Mick, I beat Mick Hizal on one of the circuit experiences as well, so... Mikhail Hazal is like, he's done. Career's over, mate. Again, I've taken... Let's do that properly. That corner is uh, deeply misleading me. Right, turn in early. Okay, there's the speed. Goodbye. Goodbye. Turn it in. Z4 takes it nicely. That can be a bit quicker, but... We're going for gold. That's all that matters. Oh, that was close to the barrier. Absolutely scintillating goldness here. You're witnessing greatness, guys. Honestly. Mm -mm. Right, next up is um, Sector 3, which is the last two big left handers up the hill. Back onto the motorway again. Where am I braking? Oh, that'll do, won't it? That'll do. Where's the exit? I'll take that. Okay. Oh, right. I can't wait for Tokyo to be to be over. They need to bring back Tokyo R two four six. They need to do it. Not these Tokyo tracks. R246, bring it back. Thank you, Caleb. I've been sat in my room doing licenses all day. Licenses, I mean... If you if you got to S10, that one's tricky. That one is tricky, yeah. Thank you, Classy. I will read that in a moment. Let me uh, let me just smash this one out of the park first, and then uh, I'll get back to you. Love the content. You're the reason I I haven't given up on racing games. Wow, that's a beautiful tale right there, my friend. Right, turn in early for this one. Could have held more power. Are oh, we going to continue? Mm, had to lift. It's going to hit the wall. Two corners left. Where did I break? About 75, I think. Wow, I had that, and I just powered too much. 
What was that? That was really stupid. That's what that was. Did you get golden S10? Yes, I have a gold. They wiped the time from the leaderboard, though. I think they changed that. Um, I think they changed that event. Because I got that. I got a gold on that like last week. Um, and then my my time isn't on the leaderboard. Um, my time isn't on the leaderboard, but um, it says I've. It still says I've got a gold. Big fan from Saudi Arabia, keep being fast. We'll see if I'm actually fast, but if I am fast, I'll keep being fast. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ashcat, as well. Nice to see you, Alex Albon's twin. Oh, that's deep. Cut back, late apex. Okay. Trying a little bit too hard. I don't need to push this much. How close do I reckon I can get on a controller? Well, the thing is, I'm out of practice with the controller. I think if I practice for a couple of months, I can get back to where I was before. But I don't think I could be too far off. Plus, I'm not really setting the greatest times here I'm quite a long way off what I could really get I could probably get quite close to these times I'm doing here on a controller with a little bit of warming up and practice Okay, that's through there. That's nice. Oh, really, just one corner left, or two corners. Don't mess it up now, mate. Don't be such a silly billy. goes on forever that final corner goes on forever i'm still there now okay that was a that felt good let's see um if it's good enough if it isn't then i'm truly stuck there's the flag there it is yes 1.6 quicker. Thank you, Peter, for the 227. Do you think driver physics are too hard? Um, I think in some cars it's overdone. I don't know about it's too hard, but I think in certain cars it's... Like, the LMP1 cars just don't have much grip. It's really weird. They should be very grippy. So I do think it's a little... Yeah, in that context, I guess it is too hard. They made them not grippy enough. Let me just open my window a little bit. Getting absolutely bacon in here. One second, I'll be back.
Got the shorts on now. This is when you mean business. When the shorts go on. Thank you, RO, for calling me a pig. Cheers, ma'am. The good old pig meme. Who remembers that? Thank you, Dare. Ozzy Flow. Ozzy Flow. Ozzy Flow. Wow, Mega Lap. Where did that come from? Good old Lewis Hamilton. We need Lewis Hamilton DLC on this, don't we? Just for the 100 million credits. Nothing else. How can I play without shoes? I think it's harder to play with shoes because you get less sensitivity on your on the pedals. Oh, I actually hit the wall there. Thank you, Felix. Have you been able to play GT7 on your PS4? No, not yet. Not yet, mate. So yeah, I don't know how how it is on a uh, PS4. I've, what I've from what I've heard is just slower loading times. Your PlayStation 4 will sound like Sony Airlines, um, and that's about it, really. I don't think it's maybe a couple of frame rate drops if it's on a wet weather race, but it's still very playable from what I've heard. Okay, that's a bit deep. Thank you, Iwan Thomas. 42. Yeah. How do you make your force feedback not sound like a seven Richter scale earthquake is happening in the room below? I think it's more that would be more down to your rig, probably, wouldn't it? Um So for me, I mean I'm on a Simlab P1, so like there's not really any flex here. It doesn't shake when I use it. It's probably down to the rig. So if you're attaching it to an ironing board. It's probably going to be a bit, a bit of vibration there. Depends what, you know. Put sponges under your table legs. There we go. Sim Racing 101. Right, the final couple of corners now. Oh, I hit the wall. Is that the Supra? It is indeed. There it is. Oh, okay. Yeah, I didn't carry enough speed in the first couple of corners. Thank you, Deep Pavey. Um, right. Let's get a bit better at this, shall we? Be a bit more brave. Throw it in there. Look at that. You can rely on the downforce. It's there. It's there to be used. Oh, that was oh, that was a good run. Well ahead of the ghost. See that ghost? Yeah, it must be the ironing board. There we go, mate. Yeah, you don't want to be using an ironing board, ideally, mate. Uh, that's certainly going to cause some vibrations for your neighbour below. Alright, one lap attack. Tokyo South counterclockwise. Let's do it. Let's get this done, shall we? Oh, should have powered a bit more. Keep it away from the wall. 
But I didn't do that, so uh, I failed. Thank you, Reaper. Cheers, mate. Way too quick. I was about to hit the wall. Brandon Trefla. You're living out my dream job. Well, Brandon, I'm do I do this just for you, mate. This is all for you. Oh, it's too late on the power. Do you fart in the car? Pete, all the time, mate. Thank you, Reaper. Is that a can of soup, bruh? <laughs> I see what you did there. See what you did there, mate. See what you did. Outrageous comedy today. Out, absolutely outrageous comedy. Oh, that wasn't very good. Hooper Scooper 210. What a name. Thanks for streaming. This is my favourite channel. You know what? PewDiePie said that yesterday. Is he going to say that again? Where is he? Guys. Check out my new favorite channel. It is so good. Oh my god. Look at it. I don't know if you could hear that, but um, he definitely just said that this is his new favorite channel. That's what he definitely just said. PewDiePie is a Super GT fan confirmed. Not many people know that. Look at it. That's a bit wide. When I say a bit, I mean like a massive amount wide. That's actually what I mean. Final corner. Alright. Fifty-seven eight. Get in there, Lewis. Fantastic drive, mate. What was that PewDiePie? Guys. Check out my new favorite channel. It is so good. Oh my god. Look at it. Cheers, man. Cheers, PewDiePie. Appreciate that, mate. Always did think PewDiePie was a, one of the good guys. Right. Mount Panorama. We're heading to Australia, mate. Let's do it. Martin Glenn, any more with a beverage streams upcoming? Shall I go and get a beer right now? I'm gonna do it. I'll be back in 20 seconds. Drink responsibly, everyone. Thank you all. You should take out this engine for weight reduction. That's a top tier method, that is. That is actually a really good idea. We're going with... What are we drinking here? An Estrella. Is that going to focus? There it is. From Barcelona, of all places. This is going to make me... I don't know, it's probably worth... Half a second a lap, I reckon. Ah, beautiful. Right. Now we go fast around the track. Don't drink and drive, by the way. Um, this is drinking and playing a video game. So this doesn't count. Cheers, everyone. If you're cracking open a cold beer at home, then uh, I salute you. Enjoy it. Drink it in. Oh, understood. Right, we're going to do Mount Panorama in Cockpit View because this wheel is the wheel I'm using. How about that? 
How about that for a little fact? Well, it's not exactly the same, but it's near enough the same one. So. They also aren't public roads, that's a good point. We're in the wobbly type 2 camera. Oh, what's that rotation about? Yeah, this wobbly type 2 is a bit funky. Oh my god, that's so off-putting. That is... No, can't do that. That is no. That is just no, mate. Wobble type 1, please. Let's retry that. Let's give that another another try, shall we? Yeah, Bathos actually is a public road. That is a good point, actually. That is a very good point. Oh, is that rotation is so off-putting. A lot of people ask this if there's a view where there's no wheel. But there isn't. So I, I think I'd prefer that one over this. I can't drive. I, I just can't actually drive in that view. It is so weird. I don't actually, I just actually don't like it. It doesn't... It, I don't know. Cockpit view just isn't that good on this game. Either that or I'm just rubbish, but... I, I, it'd be alright if I got used to it, but... Plus this car is just a bit understeering. To be fair. Yeah, this car is just a bit weird, actually. Yeah, take that, McLaren fans. Oh, where's the end of this one? 44-2. Yeah, that didn't feel good at all. That was rubbish. We'll go again. Yeah, I'm just too drunk. That's that's why. I'm getting really tipsy over a quarter of a beer. Quite clearly. Just can't drive. This is evidence. This is good evidence against drink driving. God, this car is so understeering. It doesn't go in. And I think I need to turn my force feedback back up. Uh, which one is it? Controller settings. This one. I think I need it higher. Okay, right. Stop messing about. Let's uh, get this done. Stop driving like an absolute idiot. And get gold. Because that's what we're here to do. Okay, that feels a lot better. I'm slower. That's a lift, but we're ahead. We're ahead. It's all right. was a bit ropey at the end there. Now we've got the very tricky sector down the hill. The descent. Okay. Yeah, this is quite a tricky bit. Thank you, Disco Fudge. I'm going to do this corner again. Wow, okay. That was really weird. Hit the I think I hit the rear end of the car into the wall. Let's give that another try. This has never been one of my best tracks. I've always been a bit off around here. Never been my best track. Oh god. Caught that one up. Don't know how, but I did. A little bit deep, but could be a gold. I don't know. Let's see. 
Yeah, it's all right. It was easy, mate. Easy. Oh, Aiden, thank thank my mum and her credit card, not me. Thank you, Aiden's mum's credit card. You will be sent to the Shadow Realm. Have you tried going for? Oh, have I tried going faster? That's what I gotta do. Thank you so much, man. I was wondering what it was I had to do. Oh, thank you for reminding me, man. And for the twenty dollars. Thank you, Harsh K. Thank you, Maldovich. Are you sure you're not an Aussie? Then I might. Oh, no. That was horrific. That was horrifically taken. Get into that corner, mate. Come on! Right. There we go. There we go. Thank you, me turns. The donation, Maldovich, Harsh K. Hey, Steve, love your content. Could you make a video showing your viewership from different countries? Would be fascinating. Could do. Um, my top demographic, or oh, my top country is United States. Then it's UK. Then third, if I recall, is Germany. Uh, fourth is Australia, I think. It's definitely USA, UK, Germany. Top three. Right, one lap attack. I can't remember the rest. A lot of people are surprised that US is top, but it doesn't surprise me because there's... I know I'm from the UK, but... But there's like six times... There's like six times more people in the United States than there is the UK, so... It makes a lot of sense that there's going to be a lot of people in the US watching. Because there's more of them. Those bloody Americans. Thank you, Evans. Oh, let me uh, get this lap done and then I can uh, chat to you. 205.5 to beat. Oh, keep it out of the wall. Slight lift. Comfort lift. Oh, that was incredible. Lap of the gods, mate. Burble racing the best track in the world. It would be an honor to one day race around this track. I don't know if you guys have seen this video. I think there's a guy in, I think it's a Lotus Exige, I think. Well, I think it's a Lotus. And he starts near the back and he goes past about 30 cars in one lap. I don't know what the video is called, but this guy just slices past everyone like it's nothing around this track. It's actually very cool. Thank you, Zach's Autosports. Have you tried Canadian beer? Uh, I've tried a couple of different beers. I, I don't know the names of Canadian beers, though, so maybe, but probably not. Possibly when I was in the United States, I might have tried some. I don't know. Okay, we have done bar first. Oh, God. I used to pronounce Barthurst wrong on purpose to annoy people. I was going, hi guys, welcome to this video on Barthurst. Like, oh, you said it wrong. <laughs> it's like, okay, thanks for the comment. Thanks for the ad revenue. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got this YouTube game sussed out, mate. 
Ah, oh, pretty funny. Good times. Thank you, Zach's Autosports. Thank you, Styles1993. Thank you, The Burble Podcast. Thank you, Jono Killer. Long time viewer and haven't played since GT5. I'm so close to going out and buying a PS5 and GT7. Do it, Jono. The Aussie Flow. Is it pronounced Bathurst or Barthurst? Barthurst. Bathurst. I think to, to circumvent that, the easiest thing to do is go... Welcome to Mount Panorama. There we go. Much easier. Then you can't be wrong. Uh, next up is... We've only got two tracks left, as far as I know. Which is Sukuba and High Speed Ring. So let's get these done. Broken. What car is it? The Lancer Evo Group 4 car, okay. Thank you, Ali. Please wish me luck on my uni work. I will need it. Ali, good luck on your uni work. Right, let's go. Oh. Okay, if this is gold, then like this game is too easy. And it's not a goal, so we'll uh, restart that. That was a sh shocking attempt at turn one. Oh. Car wants to bite my hand off there. Eh? Deep, bit deep, bit deep, bit deep there, mate. Should be good. Yeah, we're all right. No sweat, mate. No sweat, mate. <sighs> Sector two. Jack Alexander. Hi, I love you, R4M Shadow. I love you too as well, uh, Jack Alexander. You know, as long as I can remember, I've always thought, you know what, I love that guy. Thank you, Robster. Deep cut back. Two best things in the world are Belgian, Stella Artois, and Spa Francochamps. Solid shouts there, mate. Solid shouts. Oh, uh, I'll I'll give you that. Thank you, Robster. All right, is that a gold? Did we get gold? Twenty-one. No, we didn't. Don't get ahead of yourself, there, mate. Do it properly. Do it properly. Have I been to the Indy 500? I haven't. I would like to. What, what an awesome spectacle the Indy 500 is. One day I will go to it. Yeah, um, I've never... I haven't... Oh, 21 exactly. I haven't watched any motorsport in the US, actually. I would like to. I think hopefully this year I will be going to one of the American Grand Prix, Miami or Cota. Um, but the Indy 500, yeah, uh, that would be an awesome race to watch. I would like to watch a NASCAR race, actually. I would actually like to watch a NASCAR race. How about that? And an Indy, yeah, Indy car race would be. I mean, Indy 500 is Indy car, but like. Let's say a circuit like Watkins Glen or something. Do they do Watkins Glen in IndyCar? It's the kind of track they would do, isn't it? Or like Road America. I'd, I'd like to go to Road America one day. Daytona 500. Daytona 500 would be great to watch. I don't know if you guys saw the... I don't know if you guys saw, it was about a month ago, the LA Coliseum, they raced this, they did a NASCAR race around this tiny track. It was like, I don't know, it was like Northern Isle Speedway. It was smaller than Nor Northern Isle Speedway. I think they could only have like 10 cars on the track. 
It's actually very interesting to watch. Really weird. It was such a small track. Like, I think it was LA Coliseum. Like in a stadium. Like a tiny, like a... I don't know what they normally do in that stadium, but... But it was, uh, it was pretty crazy. Let's go and have a look at that. Oh, that's awful. Gold, gold, gold. Come on. Yep. Yeah, football stadium. Yeah, okay, yeah. They literally turned a football stadium. Like, American football, that is. Not soccer. Although, same size, roughly, isn't it? Into a NASCAR track. I don't know what the lap time was. It's like 14 seconds or something. Something ridiculous. Where is Brands Hatch located? Brands Hatch is in Kent, in the UK, slightly southeast of London. All right, uh, we have done 98% of circuit experience, just 2% left, which is one last track, and that is high speed ring. We get to the OG circuit last. Let's get it done, shall we? What car is it gonna, oh, it's the, um, isn't the Zonda? Yeah. Let me have another swig of beer before we do this. Thank you, Sasha Griffiths. Any tips for learning when to use uh, when to use which gears? I'm an automatic noob. Automa um manual. So, yeah, how, how how do you describe which gear to use? Often it, it does tell you which gear to use, but often what is the best way to learn manual? It's really hard to like describe it. For me, it came down to the sound. If the if the gear sounds too low, like let me give you an example. If it's revving too high, you're too low of a gear. If it's revving too low, you're in too high of a gear. So like that, if you, if you hear this sound where it's like too high pitch, you're in too high, low of a gear. And then you have this where it's sort of, mm, nothing happens. You're in too high of a, you're too high of a gear. So it's a case of just like driving the track, estimating which gear you think you should be in. It's like, oh, that was too low. You just have to remember what you did wrong. It's like, I went through that corner third. Actually, I should have been fourth. Next lap, fourth. Try fourth. Then you just correct your mistakes, lap on lap and lap. Like, to begin with, you'll probably feel like, oh, this is stupid. I'm getting everything wrong. But you just keep lapping, keep lapping. Keep trying to remember what you did, what you did wrong. And then you will get there. You can't, it's kind of the long, dull process of ingraining the gear knowledge into your head. It takes time, but the more you do it, you do it by sound a lot of the time. Just by general feel. It took me a long time to learn manual though, but this was way back on Forza. I can't even remember when I learned manual, probably like... Uh, probably like Forza 4 days? Forza 3 or 4? But yeah, I had to slowly learn to go without assists, so... What? Um, I can't remember. I think manual gears were probably one of the last things I learned. Because it is quite a daunting thing, actually, like going from automatic to manual. I can definitely see why it's not an easy thing to do, but it's just one of those things where you just have to just put the time in and just like, you might feel really bad at the beginning, but as long as you're improving, you will get better than what you are on automatic. You just have to stick with it. One millisecond. Okay. Oh. I mean, shifting up gears is easy. It's the down gears. That's the hard bit. All right, there we go. Ride the banking. So take that, ghost. 
Yeah, 0.01. That hurt. That is painful. Wow, well, we done it though. All right, this is it, guys. Um, if you keep behaving that way, uh, you will be sent to the shadow one lap attack, the final circuit experience, and then we've got all gold. Thank you, Andy Williamson, and thank you, Sasha Griffiths, for the 1082. Best advice I've gotten. Thank you so much. Been bringing your video, uh, been binging your videos for ages now. Loving them. Keep up the good work. Thank you, Sasha. Appreciate it. Don't know why, but I feel like the OG tracks in this game have been made way too wide. Um, the tracks are definitely wider in this. Yes. And I do agree. I think they are a little bit too wide. A little bit. Thank you, Reaper, again. Yeah, I've missed two now by one millisecond. Who would have thought, eh? One millisecond, or one thousandth of a second. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's not very good. It's quite a fun car, though. Let the car rotate. Then power out. Oh, almost snapped on me there. The cars do snap quite quickly. Take this almost flat. Oh, no. Bit of a lift. All right, 104. Come on. Don't do me over by one millisecond, please. There we go. Get in there, Lewis. Do we get a trophy for this? Do we get a trophy? No, it doesn't look like we do. Two and a half million in the bank. Never been so rich in my life. Is that it? Can we check? Have we done it? 100%. Nice. Okay, circuit experience is done. That took a lot longer than I thought. It took maybe... We did a four-hour stream yesterday. We streamed for two hours and a bit today. It took like six hours to get through those. That's quite a long element of the game. Oh, and I forgot. Welcome to Manchester United. Okay, all right. Um, next up, missions. I reckon we should do the missions now. Um, but yeah, we've done it. Oh yes. We've done it. Oh yes. Oh yes. What's the other one I need to get? Welcome to Manchester United. Oh, uh, the Tony Adams goal against Everton. Oh, what was the commentary? What did he say? Can you believe it? Aguero! <laughs> we need to get Aguero and... Can you believe it? Definitely need to get those two. Great banter. It really is. <laughs> this is great banter. It really is. It really is. Right, let's get these done, shall we? It really is. Um... Oh, I need to do this as well. Okay, right, mission passed. We've got more respect in the world of Gran Turismo. CJ is going to give us another mission now. First mission is... Uh, um, imagine if this game actually was free roam. You just get out of the... At the start of the race... A three, two, one, go. Get out or just rocket launcher the other person. <laughs> just like you come round on a one lap. The two people are waiting there with Gatling guns. <laughs> just <laughs> Oh my god. Start shooting the crap out of you. <laughs> Some guys in a hydro jet just blows you up. It's like for God's sake, mate, I'm just trying to have a race. Like, can you just stop trying to blow me up? Do a wow, oh yeah. We how could we forget? Wow! Okay, uh, missions. Um, what's this? Mountain climbing against the Samba buses. Alright. 
Just describe GTA. That is GTA, essentially, yeah. GTA is just like... To be fair, some of the races do look pretty fun. Like the ones where you're just racing through the sky and you can fall off. I, I might need to stream that. It does look pretty fun, actually. Oh, look at this scintillating pace. These guys have got nothing against me. Tony GC? You're a Manchester United fan? No, I'm actually an Arsenal supporter. I just like the dramatic Martin Tyler commentary. Oh, yes! Aguero! Mm hmm Thank you, Lucas. Thank you, Noah. Thank you, Jao, Fritas, Reaper as well, and Tony G C. Cheers, guys. Play any Elden Ring? No, um I haven't I mean I am playing GT7 really all now. I don't really play any other games uh these days. I don't I used like me and my brother, we used to play loads of loads of different games when we were younger. But um like these days I don't really play many other games, to be honest. Like last year, I bought that the new Resident Evil, and I played it for like an hour, and I was like, oh, I'm bored. Um, the, I think the type of game that I would play is something like if a, if a new Skyrim came out, a new Elder Scrolls came out, or like a new Fallout Fallout Five. Uh, wait, what? What is no? Fall, yeah, if Fallout Five came out, or that type of game. Like, I was looking forward to Cyberpunk, but it was a letdown. Like, that's the type of game I might play, but I haven't really looked at uh, Elden Ring, to be honest. I don't think I can really have, afford any time at the moment to play it. Rocket League, I've actually never played it, but it looks really fun. I, sh I should buy it, really. Thank you, Cole Ramsey. Um, you have 100% chance of winning if you're the only one that starts with gas. There you go, mate. Cole Ramsey, thank you. Thank you, Rendos. He's done it. Predictions on the derby. Uh, wait, is this Arsenal Spurs? Who's at home? Arsenal going to win it, obviously. That's all you need to know. Yeah, Rocket League. Um, it looks really fun. I, I've never, I've never played it, but I've watched a fair amount of it being played. So, it looks like a very good game. Right, we've got to get a high speed here. One twenty-one point two. There is no fifth gear. Twenty one point eight. Everyone's got one twenty one point eight. Is it it's like not possible to get higher than that? Yeah, some of the um I noticed on the leaderboard some of the some of the times are like you notice on the see that, like I'm the bottom of all the people who've got one twenty one point eight, probably because It looks like it just sets it to who did it first. So I've done it last, so I'm last. It's kind of silly, but... you think they'd be able to measure it to, like, two decimal places. But... Thank you, Tash Hart. Thank you, Scott. Thank you, Anonymous. Scott with a $15. Your, your friend from PSUS. You've got the good work. Tash Hart. Big fan here. Uh, let's move on to this one. Uh, watching with my seven-week-old daughter and my partner. You kept me sane during my pregnancy. Thank you. Well, I'm honoured. Keeping the whole family entertained. Isn't that isn't that incredible? Did you name your daughter Super GT in honour of this incredible YouTube channel? Middle name. Middle name. I'll, I'll accept that. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Thank you, Anonymous. What do you think about the selection of Audis in the game? Seems like the brand does not get enough love from the developers. 
But to be fair, like, the car list is a little thin overall. So a lot of brands don't, like, have the biggest selection. Oh, this car is oversteery. Oh, come on, keep it in, keep it in. There we go. Right, uh, which side is this car going? Where are you going? Oh my god, what is that line? Oh, yes, yeah, slidey. What even is it? A uh, crown, athlete crown. Okay. Mm -hmm. Absolutely smashed it, mate. I mean, the time wasn't very good, but... That's another stream for another day where we go back and set unbeatable times. We're only getting through it just to get gold now and, you know, just to complete the game, say, look, we've done it. Get some uh, gold cars as well. Uh, cars for gold. What's going on here? Slowest race of all time. Is there a fourth gear? Yes, there is. A Fiat 500 Grand Prix. We're going to take to the inside. We're hitting highs of 48 miles an hour. This is quite incredible. Absolutely scintillating speed. He's braked a bit early. We're up the inside. Oh, too much oversteer. We've killed our momentum. <laughs> I can barely make up that hill. Come on, keep going, keep going. 200 laps of Nür uh, Nürburgring Nordschleife with this in the rain on slicks. Who's up for it? Is it a one, is it two lap race? Oh my God. This will take longer than the 200 laps of Nürburgring. No fifth gear. What am I doing? 71 miles an hour. Oh my god. That's illegal on the British motorway. 71 miles an hour. Shift down. Car is struggling. It's losing speed on that hill. It is losing speed. Let's go in the interior view. And he shifted up to fourth. I need to fast and furious where I can shift up infinite amount of gears. It's like 400 miles an hour. Taking the apex. Oh no, no, no. What the hell? Wow, that went around so quick. Right, don't you think about overtaking me, mate. God, it takes about 10 years to get back up to speed. Excuse me, car, do you want to accelerate? Uh, well, I'll think about it. I'll let you know. Oh, cheers. Okay. Hurry up, though. <sighs> oh, there's a corner there. Too much power, yeah. How did I spin this car out at like four miles an hour? <laughs> How have you done that? Thank you, Sir Phipps. He's on the brakes hard. These carbon ceramic brakes. He stopped on the sixpence. Oh, he's taking the apex. Downshift because you're going to lose speed up this hill. How's it losing speed on that? Just powered by a potato or something. Right, there we go. Get in there, Lewis. That's a, that's a, that's a miracle drive, mate. You've just won the Italian Grand Prix there, mate. Woo, okay. Let's move on. What a scintillating victory that was. Oh, Samba bus. Go on, son. 
Thank you, Aaron Blom. Thank you, Anonymous. Have you tried playing sport mode on stream after the game's release? I hate how the meta car is formed up now. I love seeing people experimenting with different cars. Yeah, it looks like everyone's using the R32 Skyline. I've only done a little bit. I did that on release day and... Um, yeah, the people driving now... The, the tunes people have now on multiplayer are way quicker than what I was driving a few days ago. So people are working it out. The Jeep. Nice. And thank you, uh, Aaron Blom. It's easy to spin out when when the car's only four foot long, yeah. That's a good point. Yeah. Thank you, Aaron. Thank you, Zach. The character model in Cockpit drives with one hand. Right, on to the next one. We did these on Scott Chegg account on release day, but we'll get through these quickly. And then we can move on to the ones like that I haven't that I haven't done. Shouldn't take too long. Mm, 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 mm. Where's he? Look at that! What AI just swerving across? Are you asking for an a for an accident there, mate? Right. Where are you going there, Honda S800? Daniel Joseph, thank you very much, good sir. Is there a website to track driver rating yet? Uh, not that I know of. Maybe Kudos Prime. I haven't even looked on Kudos Prime to see if there's a Gran Turismo 7 section on it. But Oh, you can't ram the opponents. Don't do that. Um, but yeah, I don't know yet if there's a website. Kudos Prime, possibly. I haven't looked on it. That was a lot quicker. In the slipstream. Yeah, this car kind of comes up on you at an awkward place, this this one. Just as you're going into this fast... I'm going to dive bomb it. That's not even a dive bomb really, is it? That's actually just a good overtake. All over the kerb. Thank you, TCR Nipper Dog. Get into this corner. It's a bit slidey, this car. On the power. Make the most of the track. There we go. This feels like a good little run. Mr. Scott Shag. What a name. Thank you, Bilbo Faggins. Thank you, uh, TCR Nipper Dog. Look at that. Number one on our friends list. Goat level performance. Just incredible stuff, really, isn't it? Just like absolute, absolute greatness being achieved. Right, one lap magic. Oh, we've got to go back to Tokyo. Done enough of Tokyo. Right. Oh, it's this one. We have to catch up. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Have I played with the DD Pro or GT7 yet? No. I haven't actually. I'd imagine it'll be more than good enough. I think. The good thing about the DD Pro is that um, it has the dials for like TCS, ABS, uh, brake bias, sorry fuel balance and you can just switch them and that's I think it's the only wheel that does that it might be a Thrustmaster one that does it but okay you can hit the wall you can hit the wall let's go what the hell that was all over the place I always forget Nissan GTRs just have no brakes thank you Scott Jag I'm the real OG egg oh yeah you wanna you wanna go son Let's just forget that we hit the wall. That that didn't happen. It's been an otherwise faultless run. Apart from that.
Right, we need to get ahead of him. Oh, 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 no. Okay, I don't really deserve to uh, get a gold here because this is like diabolical driving. It's quite simply, this is a crime against driving. I've done driving a disservice today by my shameful actions here. This is just not good enough. Thank you, Lord Pepsi. Watching all the GT7 got me playing GT3 on the OG PS2. Mate, what a game. On a PS2 as well. What a legendary console that is. Around the outside. Get a load of that, mate. Oh, no. He's come back. Drag race. Yeah, get out of it, mate. Okay. Do apologise for committing crimes against motorsport. Committing crimes against driving. Um, but we're going to get gold. We'll just take it. Take it and run, you know. AD Gibbons, thank you, good sir. Thank you very much, mate. All right, we move on. Is the R35 bad handling wise? It, it doesn't. It just doesn't have that much grip, really. It feels a bit loose. Generic Porsche with a training wheel on it. What a name. Daniel Joseph as well. Thank you. Dion Iso got carried over from GT Sport. Thoughts? Yeah, I mean, I don't think it's such a bad decision. I think it's all right. I think it's... I think it's um, the right call. Although I wouldn't, I wouldn't... It doesn't matter to me either way. you napoleon pour some alcohol into your system i will do in a brief moment good sir so this car gonna go what i have to beat 155.3 And we have done it. Fish and chips. Someone rang. Uh, yes, I'd like some fish and chips, please. Oh, no. Don't do it again. Thank you, fish and chips. Thank you, a drunk pirate. Still thinking to get GT7 to PS4, but those loading times are massive. But a turn off for me, I think. IGN talked about 40 seconds for a track. It is pretty long. Yeah. It's still playable. But it is pretty long. You've got to be pretty committed that you are going to do that race before you click start race, you know? You've got to know that that's the race you want to do. Let's try that again. Let's do that properly. Let's do that properly, shall we? What's a two lap race? Okay. I'm gonna go wide. Do the old switcheroo. It's the old switcheroo! Oh my. Jesus. We kept it on. Oh, this car is. Power understeer. You have to be really delicate on the throttle on this one. Can't see a thing. Let's brake there. Get two wheels up on the curb, on the grass. Okay, that was alright. We get past the Subaru. I don't know where this car's going. I'm going to go to the inside, it'll be safer. Two cars to overtake. Should be alright. Should be able to do this. 
Thank you, Matt Paul. Late on the brakes up the inside of the Supra. Could have braked a little bit later there. For sure, but we're going to run with it. Shall I just rocket launch this guy? Oh, I need to get the rocket launcher meme on my Elgato stream deck. Oh, the old switcheroo, last second. He's going to do one on me now. No, he's not. That's what I thought, mate. Oh, I just... <laughs> so much understeer. Just does not want to go in. Oh, keep it on, keep it on. A little bit deep. Pivot. Cut back. Drive off the turn. Now just... Oh, my God. Now just don't go off on the final corner. Another donation there. Thank you for the $1 tip. And Matt Paul as well. One last corner to go. Oh. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. That was all right. Matt Paul quite pissed off. And they have every Euro hot hatch, but my own Giletta QV. Don't have Julia QV. Always lacking on alphas. They put all their budget onto the 155, my friends, unfortunately. Okay. Cone challenge. Uh, okay, this one was pretty fun, actually. Quite enjoyed this. So, let's give it a jolly good go. It's an electric car. There is no sound to be heard. Well, a little bit. I missed the, I missed the cone. Wow, wow, wow. You failed. Beherit669, thank you for becoming a member, my friend. Ooh, that was good. 14217. How does that stack up on my friend's leaderboard? Nowhere near the top. 13.1 is the quickest. Let's have another go at that. Which actually you think are your favourite GG7 at the moment? Has a fun pure racing. I really like Deep Forest, actually. I think Deep Forest is up there for me. I keep missing that fourth one. Let's give this another go quick. Yeah, Deep Forest. I really like that. I just like the flow of the track. Got a bit of everything, you know? Oh, I missed one again. Missed, missed. No, just missed one. Okay, come on. I can get get a thirteen at least. There we go. That was a bit quicker. That was a decent time. We can go quicker. Someone's at a 13 1. I'd like to see that. Drift mission, alright. Maintain drift angle by counter steering. Tell me to smash like right now. I might have to. Well, yeah, smash like, mate. Right, let's try that again. Horrific entry. Thank you, Remy. Oh, mate. There you go. That's really fun, actually. I saw your M2 competition video a while ago and it inspired me to get one before they start making them. I love it and it's quickly become my favourite car for the China F F8X generation. Sad I didn't see it in the G7 car list. Yeah, it's not in the game. M M2 competition, mate. 
such a good car. It's a very good car. Let's give that another go. This is really fun. I, I reckon I can get into the 9,000s. Have to cross the finish line. Trophy earned! 10,000 drift trials, okay. That's pretty good fun. One more try, one more try. One more try. I definitely said two more tries just then, didn't I? Yeah. That's what I said. 100% I said that. Nah, no. It's really fun trying to... It's a good corner for drifting. I, I, I want a few more tries. Yeah, it's hard to get dead right though. Yeah, that's, that entry line was not good. I started too late as well. I don't know about the upshift. I think you'll lose power in it. I think third is the right gear. Uh, maybe, maybe fourth. But I think it's struggling for power in the fourth gear. Alright, that'll do. We'll come back to that one one day. It's, it's fun though. Fourth gear to carry more speed, yeah. Okay. Next time. The pass. Oh no, not Fisherman's Ranch. The worst place on the planet. Oh no, this trial. I hated this one. Stupid AI. Oh, you almost got me. Jump into that gap. Oh, hello. Right, where's he going? No, I'm in the wall. That is so stupid. Come on, man. Thank you, Kieran Ainsworth. Oh, no. That is all over the place. Oh, what the hell was that? <sighs> Go to the moon then. What the hell? These bounces on the dirt. It's all over the place. Take it nice and easy over this one. Oh, 
Okay, right, let's don't mess up this corner at the bottom here. Oh, okay, we got it done. That's uh it's always just such a ropey challenge. It's all over the place with those chumps. Throws you about. All right, what have we got next? The last one, Eco Challenge. Is this the one lap of Sardinia, I think? This was a really fun challenge. Let's see what we can do. Oh, don't, don't use fuel. Thank you, Tash Hart. If I have a little boy, I'll keep Steve in mind. Yes, please. I would be honoured. Okay, it's going to be this big uphill, which is a big pain. I can just coast from here, I think. <sighs> no, that is so stupid. I don't think I'll pass it now because of the time. Yeah, that, that stupid mistake cost me. Let's go again. Stupid. Sly old fox. Great to see you lots of streaming. Hope it continues. Thank you very much, man. Yeah, I... Why? Oh, I burnt 4% of fuel there. I don't use any fuel. <laughs> That's so stupid. What am I doing? Deji just lost his fight. Deji, Deji. What are you like, mate? Alright. This is a fun challenge. I do like these little set pieces. Wide. Come on, get up the hill, mate. Into six here. It's downhill. Coast it in. Back on the power. Short shift. Is that helping or not? I don't know. Okay, that's where I lost all the time. Yeah, that's... Oh, so, that lost, lost me like three seconds. I 
I go wide. Oh. I have fuel to spare, if anything. I still have 2% left. I could probably go half a second quicker than that. Top of my friends list. Look at that. I could probably... I had, what, 2% fuel? 3%? Could have gone a little bit quicker. Definitely. But... Timed it right. That was good. That was a decent little run there. Oh yeah, let's see what cars we get. So, for bronze, we get the Honda Civic. And for gold, it is the RX-7. All right. Yeah, I think that challenge, the fuel saving one, is like... If you're going downhill... Well, in the middle downhill, I used six and I short-shifted. At the end, I waited for the last straight then used all the power but i'm sure there's different ways of doing it right okay i haven't done these ones yet so let's give them a go rolling stone the pass nurburgring well, overtake all of the cars on the, f on the first section of the nurburgring nordschleife your chances to overtake lie between the corners okay thank you for the information there friend and the SLR McLaren, this thing is going to be an absolute boat. Is this a hark back to Mission 34 on Gran Turismo 4? I know it's not, it's only Sector 1, but right, let's dive up the inside there. This car is going to be very boaty, isn't it? I'm going to dive bomb this guy. Out of the way, son. Dive in there, thank you. Over the curb, over the grass a little bit. Where are we going to get this guy? On the exit of the left. All right. Sub 50 seconds. There we go. Super GT. For, someone did a 49.5. I reckon I could... Let's try and do one more. Try and beat a 49.5. I reckon I can do that. One more try. I was pushing it a little bit too hard there. This car, I don't know. I was overcooking the apexes. You never want to overcook it, mate. Oh my god, I'm all over the place. Come on, keep it together. No, I've been blocked. This run is definitely slower. Oh, it's so sketchy on power. No, it won't be quicker. I know I can... I, on that failed attempt, I got the first sector really good. Right. You can tell by where you overtook the cars. Right, that's tidy. Keep it tidy. So look at that. I'm going past this guy a lot, a lot earlier. Minimal throttle input. Minimal.
just touched him. I don't know why I keep trying this, but he is addicting trying to perfect your score. It is addicting. Are the AI always in the same position? So I caught this guy quite late here. So that should be a 50.2 or something again. Yeah. Okay. That's enough of that. I'm stuck on the A9 license that happened in the, in the NSX. Mm, yeah. I found that one all right. You just have to be very patient on the throttle. Yeah, one more time was about eight more. Uh, right, what's this? Uh, aim for the top in the road car racing. Okay. It's like a one, a uh, three lap race. All right. TCS on, no. Yeah, some of these missions are going to be quite long, I think. They're not going to be all, like, 10 seconds. Some of them, I think, go on for, like, 20 minutes in the end. But we'll get to those. Oh, my God, no. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'll break a lot earlier than that. That was shocking. Oh, I'm sick of doing Tokyo today. There's so many Tokyo tracks. Yeah, that A9 license is quite tricky because it doesn't have much grip on the exit. So you have to be really delicate on the power. Wait, what car is this again? This on GTR, yeah. The GTR was like this on Forza. It just has loads of power, but the brakes just aren't as aren't good enough. I don't know if it's actually like that in real life, but Ferrari F40, what a car! Where do we break here? I'm going with 200 board. Yeah, that's about right. Thank you, Austin. You want to do a run of the S10 license on stream for the boys? I can do, mate. Maybe not today, but at some point. I have actually already got gold, but I can do it again. Thank you, Napoleon. You can have the drink. You cannot have the drink. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We're going to have to throw in a wall right there. Oh, oh, oh I'm, af I'm, I'm afraid, guys. AI on the inside. Oh, he's fighting back. Thank you, Stefan. Super TT Tokyo Goat. Wall riding goat, more like. Good at wall riding. That's all I'm good for. The OG. The OG tactic in racing games. The classic wall ride. got to have a good wall ride in your arsenal, haven't you? Oh, 
come on. Yeah, you do have to, it takes a while to learn this car. Who's in the lead here? 4GT and a Diablo? I get the 200 there. Get it into the corner. Perfect. They're using the handbrake. Do they just use the handbrake? Both of them. They just use the handbrake. What the hell? What the hell? That was so weird. They used the handbrake. <laughs> what am I seeing? I remember watching... Oh, what was it? I think it was like GT Academy qualification. Um, like GT5. I don't know if you guys... Uh, I've never played GT5, but... There was a track. I think it was GT5. It was like a twisty one in the mountains. And there was like tight hairpins and people just people using handbrake. And it was like... It was a qualifying event for GT Academy. Oh, yes, I didn't hit the wall. Oh, four GTs going back. I'm going to try around the outside. Uh, the old switcheroo. Swiss Alps. Yeah, Eiger Nordvans. Yeah, it might be one of those. And I remember... Because I've never played it, but I, I watched people play. I think it was when Jan Mardenberg got the... Um, the drive... In GT Academy, it was that year, I think. People, yeah, using the handbrake. But that has sometimes been a quicker method. It's been... It depends on the game, and... Like, you just get a little bit of rotation using the handbrake, and sometimes it actually works. Certain cars, usually around hairpins. Quick, cheeky dab of the handbrake, you know? Thank you, Banch versus Game. Thank you very much, mate. Right, breaking at the 200 board. There. Two, three, four. Drive it in to the apex. Keep the brake on. Keep the brake on. L release the brake. Keep it tight. Drive off in a straight line. Jobs are good. And we've just won the Japanese Grand Prix. Fantastic drive, mate. You are the world champion. Hey mate, love your content. How are you liking the new physics? What are some of the key things you suggest to get used to it? Um, I am liking them. I think in some places they're a little bit too uh, dramatic. I'll say the main thing for me has been not driving at 100%. So really being really careful with like throttle application. Just being really, just being more gentle. So you can drive really hard and push the car in, but tends to not work I would say so oh drag race okay use your car to enter all right uh, well I might as well just what am I up against focus on the start signal uh, all right use any car <laughs> Red Bull X2019 Let's make this a fair-ish fight. I don't know what car they've got. It looks like an Audi TT, but we'll see what actually we're going to be racing against. In drag races, gear shifting is done manually, and your car's TCS traction control system is disabled. All right, okay, Ford GT versus Audi TT. Oh, goodbye, mate. Oh, that was so close. Can't believe how close that was. Why do they make you... What have people used? GTR Nismo. R34. It looks like the R34 has got good launch off the line. How quick was mine? Mine was really slow. 11.9. Well, <laughs> absolutely showed him who's boss, didn't I? Bring a better car next time, mate. Next up, mileage trial. Get as far as you can on limited fuel. 
Okay. I do like the fuel ones. Maybe I'll hate them after this. How is the... Look at the guy top of the leaderboard. He's gone like way further than everyone else. How has he done that? He's gone like nearly a... He's gone a mile further than everyone else. All right. Interesting. Oh, don't use fuel. You have like... You have to get as far as you can. Oh, right. I see. Okay. You're going to have to accelerate really slow then. Oh, this is interesting. There are... Hmm. Thank you, Pooper Scooper. For the donation, mate. Okay. And coast it here. Let it get round here. Come on. Let's get over that hill. Get over that hill. Let it roll. Keep rolling. Keep rolling, rolling. Yeah, higher gears. You nice and smooth. It's actually rolling pretty far. A little bit of power there. Too low of a gear. You're aiming for about a lap and a half, okay. That's going to be, yeah, I need to do this a lot better. Just turn the engine off. Hmm. I'd love to see how the top guy did their run. It's quite a cool challenge, yeah, yeah it's actually pretty interesting. Is it going to roll up this hill? 40 miles an hour. Come on. That might be too far. Yeah, I'm going to have to use a bit of power here. Yeah, that wasn't a very good use of momentum there. Thank you, Lord Pepsi. How about a G-Force trial? Don't spill your drink. That would be pretty funny, actually. I have to go in cockpit view and there's a little Pepsi can. Pepsi bottle or something. Right, make it through here. I'm going to need more power now. Make it over this crest. Make it over the crest. That's it. Roll down the hill. <laughs> what, what a weird challenge. It's very cool, though. I really like this. Right. Let it roll down here. Should be able to set this corner flat. Let it roll down. Sixth gear. Now, just let it roll here, because there's a hill. Hopefully, I don't have to break for this last corner. Alyssa Faden, thank you for the $50 super chat, the super sticker. Thank you very much. That's very, very nice of you. I'm going to have to do a Scandinavian flick into here. Will that go around? A little bit of a break. 
Thank you, Alex Howe. Need more speed. Right, let that roll. Well, I've got gold. So gold is one lap. For reference. Gonna have, I'm going to have to go uphill here. Yeah, it's kind of... Yeah... I think I have to experiment with this challenge to see what really is the best way to do it. Because when you go in high gear, like, you don't get any acceleration, so... Get out and push. Oh, if I can just get through the tunnel, I'll be alright, but... No, nah, I've run out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop in the tunnel, aren't I? I'll get to four miles, get to four miles, get to four miles. Uh, come on, four miles. Yes. Ah, uh, if I could have just got up there, I would have rolled down and rolled down the next section. I could have got another half a mile. Yeah, I want to try that again. Let me see the leaderboards. I could... Yeah, lots of people are doing a lot better. That was my first try, though. Yeah, if I could just get over that hill, that's another half a mile. But uh, Thank you, Alyssa. Thank you, Alex Howell. Thank you, Matt Paul. Thoughts on Mazepin out of Haas? Um, not really bothered by it. I mean, a lot of the time, you know, a lot of drivers are in a team because they have a sponsor. So if the sponsor can't provide anymore, then the driver can't be there. So it is what it is, unfortunately. Okay, right. Drive at a low speed, yeah. Oh, this is a this is a really good challenge. I think lots of people are going to try this one and really. Uh... Yeah, higher gear, but it just doesn't it doesn't accelerate, and then you get no speed. But wait, right. yeah, it does go down slower. Okay, let me try that. Just trying to judge it. Wait. How slow does it go? Okay. Let's just deal with the slow acceleration. Thank you, Woodman Gaming. Drive like you drive your regular car, yeah. But if you're going to do it in this gear, you have to put some throttle on. Let's try this method. It's going to be really slow, but... Get up the hill. Get up the hill. It's broken. It's broken. Thank you, Josh. Let's go a little bit quicker. In lower gear. Opera. Now this is some content. This is a good challenge. I quite like this. It's something different, isn't it? Right. <laughs> so slow. I'm f full throttle. 
Trevi, stay cool, we're bringing you the white flight, so stay cool, we're in a good position. Right, just roll over this hill. 77% there. Thank you, Tash, for becoming a member. Right, let's let it, ro let it roll now. There's a quarter. Keep it smooth. Thank you, Tony GC. Someone said turn off the AC. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Op uh, close all the windows. Close all the windows, turn off the AC. Get rid of unnecessary weight in the car. Right, let's get some speed up here. So I can possibly just make it over the hill. How much, how much do I need? 60 miles an hour. Till I'm on 60%, then I'll stop. That's enough to get over this hill. That is perfect. Please be enough. Wash the car. Yep. Just roll over this hill. Come on. Just roll over that hill. Thank you, Lord Pepsi. Remove passengers. Yep. Come on. Just a little bit further. Just roll over that hill. That is all you got to do there, mate. 22 miles an hour. We're still going. You've got to be so patient on this <laughs> challenge. You see my ghost is already at like the penultimate section. Okay, we've just made it over that hill. And we're gaining speed. Okay, good. 59% left. We're going to have to go around this corner. Use a bit to go up the hill. Then let it run down the hill to, to the final corner. Okay, 48 miles an hour. Nice and smooth through here. Smooth as possible. Gonna have to use a bit. Right, just roll up there. Roll up there. Maybe a little bit too much there. Use a bit too much. We should be able to carry this all the way through to the final corner now. Still with 49% left. Okay, let it roll. Let it roll. Let it roll. Turn it in. Nice and smooth. Yeah, I think I used too much back there. Because I've got in more than enough speed now. So you can get away with just creeping over a hill. And it will act, the car actually rolls quite freely quite quickly. So I've got to just attack this. Okay, don't scrub off any speed. So what's the best point to use... Acceleration here. Okay. That's one lap. We're in a much better position than last time. What would five miles be? Roughly the end of that long straight again? At the end of the lap? I am going to have to use more to get past the tunnel. I think it's best to do it early, isn't it? Use it going downhill there. Okay, please say that's enough. Get up there, mate. Go on. Get up there. Get round there. 
This is it's quite long, this corner. It's not going to be enough. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Come on. Let's get over that. Yes, come on. Come on. Ooh. Now keep rolling, mate. We've beaten our last time. Thank you, Philip. Cheers, Mum. This reminds me of slow cruising Skyline Drive. When you're on, yeah, no fuel left on an economy run. Hmm. Right, so the first bit of the straight goes downhill, doesn't it? So we can gather speed again to get over that. Right, just roll. Just get over that little crest there. Cut the corner a little bit. 14%. Right. I think it's best to accelerate going downhill. I think you gain more doing that. So let it free roll here a little bit. Wait, six for yeah. Um I need to get what was it about? Come on. Keep rolling, mate. Keep rolling, mate. 19, 17, 16. More. That wasn't ideal. 3.9% to get up the next hill after the hairpin. 3.8. If I can get up that hill, I can roll through the last corner and down the main straight. But only if that percent is enough. 3.6 is going down. We're over that hill. Maybe do it now. Right, that's it. Ah, oh, no, come on. Most people ran out on this hill, I think. That's it. Yeah, we're done. We're done. Oh, if we could just get over that hill. That hill. Oh, if you get over that hill, you go another mile. Oh. If you get over that hill, you go another mile. That's how the guy... Look, we got second. The guy at the top of the leaderboard got over that hill. And he rolled all the way to the main straight. <sighs> yeah, I think try again. Yeah, we got, we got to do it. We got to do it. Oh man, that is the su that's such a good challenge. That is such a good challenge. Use neutral. I don't think I don't think you can go into neutral. Wait, let's just have a look. Can you can you use neutral? There's no downshift into neutral. It's just like...
Yeah, I've, I've done way worse there. I want to come back to that. Uh, I'll, we're going to move on for now, but... We're going to... One day, we're going to get number one on this. We're going to get number one. We'll come back to it. I was, what, 10 meters away? 20 meters away? If I just get over that hill. Just get over that hill. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, this is pretty tricky. Oh. Oh my. This car's it's a weird drift car. It's a group four car. Oh. Oh my my god, it's a bit tricky to get used to this. Yeah, I'm not a drifter. I can definitely tell you that. You can probably work that out. Sorry, this is... <laughs> All right, there we go. <sighs> yeah, more 360 um, rotation, which doesn't help, but we've done it. Let's move on. <laughs> Get away from it. Get away from that. Thank you, uh, Benjamin Ford. It's a tricky one, but we've done it. Let's move on. It's once you get in the slide, it's like then just like being patient on the throttle, but it's quite a tricky car to drift that. What's this? Daytona at night. Love it. Thank you, Suzuki CL. So one lap race. That was a bit stupid, wasn't it? Thank you, Kevin. Best challenge so far. Um, yeah, I, I really liked... I actually enjoyed that challenge, the fuel one. I think that was very good fun. Um, I reckon I can definitely do that one, you know, and... Uh, I mean, the annoying thing about these leaderboards is that it's only your friend's leaderboard. It would be really good to have a global one. I think they're definitely missing out there by not by not giving us a global leaderboard. I think that's a bit silly to not include that. I think that's one thing that Gran Turismo doesn't do that well is like leaderboards. Because Forza like gives you, if anything, too many leaderboards. Gran Turismo doesn't give you enough. Um, but yeah. I've got a second on my friends list, so I think that's pretty good. My goodness. Okay, just the bus stop. Oh, it finishes there. So there is no bus stop. Okay. Nice. Let's move on. I'm getting through it. No. <laughs> Don't do it again. Do not do that again. Uh, next one. Nearly 3 million credits. 
It's amazing, you can just blow all that in one go very quickly on one car. It's taken me many days to gather that. Daytona again, okay. On the oval this time, 211.3 for gold. What about driving smoothly in the slipstream? Let's do it. Definitely said 0.7, but okay. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Bless me. Oh. Right. I've got 217. Fair enough. What do you think about the microtransactions? Um, I don't think it's fair or unfair. It's just like, but use them if you want to use them. Don't if you don't. Um, I do think the game is too hard to get credits on, but I'm not going to buy them, so I, I don't. It doesn't really bother me. Thank you, uh, John O'Killer, as well. Just seen your donation, and uh, Kevin Wong. I've right, got to wait for this one. One lap attack. Trial Mountain. These missions are good. I, I like these missions. Good fun. Something different. 787B through the tunnels. Don't you know it? Oh, listen to that. And I can burn all the fuel I like. lines are taken. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, the speed difference. Absolutely ballistic. Right, where do we break here? I'm going to go the outside. I didn't know where he was going. Well, it's going to be mission failed then. We're hitting the. Come on. He's there. I should be able to out out accelerate him. Yeah. Woo! Okay. Thank you, Jono. Thank you, Connor O'Brien. Thank you, Lee. Approved missile. Yeah, all right. It's been about time, isn't it? Boom. Take that, trial mountain. All right, 787B defeated.
Congratulations. Okay, we got the Mustang. Mm -mm. And we get the Corvette. A couple more Group 3 cars. Well, a Group 4 and a Group 3. Fantastic. Thank you. Level 31. Ooh, okay. We've done half the missions. Moby Dick. Actually, no, we've done more than half the missions. We've done one of the later ones. The Pass. Let's go. When are Group 3 races coming onto online? Who knows, mate? Who knows? Hopefully soon, but we'll see. Whoa, understood. Cybertruck. That'd be an interesting addition to the game. Oh my god, this car's got no grip. Oh my god, I thought I braked early there. Still barely made the corner. It's a chunky old thing, this is. Probably more of a drift car, really, isn't it? Oh, God. This car is going to be in the way, isn't it? Oh, where do I go? Where's it going? I have no idea where it's going. Whew. Right, come on. In the slipstream. Oh, no. Is that car on the green car? Couldn't judge where it was going. I got on the brakes earlier. Yeah. There we go. That's better. It's a lot better. Okay, we're definitely ahead this time. I should catch this guy in a better position. Go around there. Yeah. Okay. Right. Should be good. Oh, miles better. Boom. So much better. Woo. Thank you, Nick. Big sad. NSX 92 sold out. Is that in the Legend dealership or something? Or the used cars you'll have to wait for it to come back round again mate he's done it right what's up next Sukuba. 30 if laps behaving that way uh, you will be sent to the shadow realm 30 laps oh I don't know if I'm ready for 30 laps right now let's do let's do a drag race um LMGT LMG Tonka a PS5 just to play GT7 because you made me fall back into sim racing after years of your videos. Any updates on when you may get to drive in the BMW or at Nürburgring again? Um, I'm going to let you guys know what I'm racing this year very soon. And it's going to be very cool. No! Oh, you can't ram them off. Okay, that was actually a really close race. Thank you, Arthur. Ah, uh, get a load of that, mate. Are there only romance dialogue options for Sarah? There's actually, yeah, there's actually a story mode here. Is it like Mass Effect where you can make people try and f fall in love with you? Sukuba so race takes about 35 to 37 minutes. Okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll get back to that one, I think. We'll, we'll do the faster ones first. What's this? They're in a square. Wait, what? 
Oh, I actually hit that. Why is it in chase cam? No. No, all right, let's start again. How many trophies do you unlock? Um, how do you? Thirty out of fifty-four, sixty-one percent, eighty-one hours played apparently already. <laughs> Whoops. Oh no, that's not the right way to do it, but... No. I nearly had it the first time, if I just got that one cone. Right, I think chase cone is actually, yeah, chase cone is better because you can see where the cones are. Right. Oh no. <laughs> Come on. Hmm, 12.6. Okay, I just need to get that slide on that second cone. No, it wasn't good enough. Yes, come on. Bang on. No sweat, mate. Easy. Come on. Someone's done that in 10.6. Jesus. Hey, Tijney. How's it going, man? That deserves a... Wow. Bang on the limit, lads and lasses. That's how you do it. Why, you know, why do it any faster when you can just do it bang on time? You know? What's the rush? What's the rush? Oh, no. Let me start, let me start again. Woo! Okay. Yeah, boy. Okay. We'll take that. We'll take it and run. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you. Eco challenge. Oh, here we go. Here we go again. These freaking eco challenges. These are good. Right. What do we have to do? Control. Okay, so this one's a bit more attacking. You have to push it a little bit.
I really need to save fuel there. Okay, yeah, I could have pushed. Oh, I, I saved too much. Uh, thank you, Joel. Hi, Steve. Long time viewer. So long overdue donation. Do you feel the licenses are as challenging as previous GT games? Do you like the new game as much? Um, I love the game. Are they as challenging? Well, it's hard. Like, I think the old licenses are harder to get gold. But I don't know if that's because, like, I'm better now than I was when I was younger. I think, still, if I try to play GT3 now and try to get gold, I'll find it hard. Okay, I saved way too much fuel on that last attempt. a bit more I had like 20% left last time don't need that much okay right come on Come on. Yes. That was pretty close. I still had too much fuel left. I could have burnt a bit more than that. But we have done it. So we can progress on to the next one. Whatever that may be. Let's have a look. The pass. Overtaking in a mixed class race. Okay. Right. Going past group three cars in the group two car. Oh, there's another group two there. Greta would be proud. Saving the planet, mate. We got the hairpin, yeah. I'll be taking that, thank you. Straight line that. So where's the finish line? Probably on the main straight. It's an interesting combination, group two versus group three. You don't normally see this. I go deep. Nip underneath. Okay, drag race. See you later, mate. Thank you. Goodbye. Thanks very much for that. You got gold for finishing in first place. Congratulations. Cheers, Sarah. Means a lot. Okay, we're flying through these. Despite skipping the long race, but we'll get to that. One lap magic. Drive the superb handling NSXR to successfully dominate a single lap on the Suzuka circuit, the home ground of the Hon of Honda Sports. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Arthur B. Thank you, Joel. Thank you, uh, Kakarot the Sixth, Alfster as well earlier. Right, got oh, starting in thirty-seven seconds. Okay, all right. Ryan Smith, have you done the Northern Isles Speedway circuit experience? I have. I've been sent to Shadow Realm. 
we finished all of the circuit experience uh, maybe two hours ago or an hour ago. Thank you, Matthew. Pick up yourself, Mr. GT. Trying to decide whether to splash the cash for a PS5 just for GT7 or waste hours on loading times on the uh, PS4. Hmm. If you can get yourself a PS5, I say do it, mate. I say go for it. Andrew Mather, thank you as well. Good to see you in the chat, mate. Good to see you again. Right, we're going to continue. See if we can still pass this. Yeah, Butmore last week was very good fun, mate. Good to get out again and race. Oh, this car is so slidey. It's very drifty. Suck them on ice. Where's the leader? Degna 2. It says I'm still a minute behind. I oh, know. There we go. Lunge into Degna 1. Not normally the place to go for an overtake, but desperate times and all that. Right, come on. We can do this. Okay, they're just going around to Spoon now. I don't know if that counter is right, saying I'm 46 seconds behind the lead. don't think that's right. It's more like 10. Get that in. Oh, that is... Oh, right on the edge. Okay, let's tuck into this guy's slipstream. Free slipstream, thank you very much. Thank you, Dash Tay. Like the stream. Don't you know it? Or oh, which where is he going? Play it safe on the inside. They have some weird lines to these AI. Right, just get to the finish. No need to do anything silly now. We've got it in the bag. Hey, thank you, IFG and Lucas and Povey for becoming members. And Javan Galagos. Galagos. I butcher most people's names, so sorry. But thank you, guys. All right. We've done it. Miracles do happen, mate. Miracles do happen, mate. Have you come across any bugs so far? Um, the only thing for me is like the sound. Sometimes when you go over curbs, the sound's like a bit weird. I don't know if that's the game with my headset. <sighs> Sakuba, 30 laps. Why would they do this to us? Do it. Oh, okay. You have to enter your own car. 600 or less. And it's a... Any, any car 600 or less. Around Sukuba. Uh sort by performance points. Let's have a look. Less than six hundred. GTR, Mercedes, SLS, GTO twin turbo. I actually quite like that car. I'm gonna go for the GTO twin turbo. Let's go. Only ten thousand for gold. Yeah. Or well, five thousand for gold here. Yeah. What the hell? Second, yeah, 34 minutes. All right. Well, we need to get it done, so. So how far are we behind? We're like nearly a lap behind. All right. I should just get in a quicker car, really, shouldn't I? All right, let's just get it done. See what lap times the AI are doing, and then it's 
take a while to catch up actually. 30 laps. Thank you. Dijabicius. I probably got that wrong. Sorry, mate, but thank you for becoming a member. The font is too small on my screen here. <laughs> Can't read it. Right. 42.6 behind the leader. Let's see how much I can gain on one lap. Where's this guy going? Around the outside, bro. I think I'm actually losing time, if anything. No. I need to gain more than a second a lap, though. So, if I'm not gaining enough, then there's no point in continuing. But let's have a look. Okay, down to 40.8. Yeah, sh it should be alright. Should be fine. Tires, though. Do the AI pit? I don't know if they do. Oh, yeah, and the, the rain, yeah. What about that? Wait, so we're not even the quickest on the track. Okay, the rain. All right, I need to put a rear bias as well. Nope, I don't have that unlocked on this car. Okay, we'll just have to make do. Here comes the rain, I can hear it. There it is. Do I know how to get a magenta on the rain radar? No, I've never seen it. I've only seen like the dark blue or like purple. I've never. I didn't gain on that lap. This is uh, quite worrying. I think I might need to go and get a quicker car. Yeah, I'm not gaining. I, I I think like it's too risky to actually continue this. Sorry. Because that car was only like five three two or something. I know that the rain will come, and you know you probably you guys have, might have seen this challenge before anyway. But uh, five eight seven. Tune, could I tune this one down a little bit? Wait. Oh, it won't let me choose it. That Sylvia would be perfect, I think. Yeah, let me back out. Let me uh, get a Sylvia. What SSD card do you have in your PS5? Um, oh, it's a Samsung 980, I think. One of those ones. Let me uh, get this Sylvia just below 600. Du, 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 du. And then uh, I think this car will be perfect. Car settings. Maybe we could just add a load of ballast. Don't have it. Keep the supercharger on. Oh, there we go. Right. 
598. Perfect. Thank you, Bryce. Hi, SuperGT. Love the vids. Thank you very much, mate. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. What percent have you got so far? Um, it's hard to say like what percent of the game I've done, but um, I've done all the licenses, done all the circuit experience. Um, a lot of the events in World Circuits. Um, it's by tires. Oh yeah, good shout. I've unlocked a lot of the events here. I haven't done all of them, but I don't know how many there are. So I think we're a decent amount of the way through, but there's going to be a lot more. Oh yeah, let's buy some inters and wets just in case. I've already got inters, heavy wet. All right. We've got quite a few different tires for this car. That's all good. Uh, Heat Dragon 26, loving the GT7 content. Wanted to ask uh, for racing online, any Shadow Realm locations? Wait, uh, which here? I should watch out for and your most iconic GT car of all time. Oh, good question. Sports hard. Wait. Car settings. Um, maybe sports hard would be better, wouldn't it? Well, the main Shadow Realm location is Dragon Trail, Chicane of Death. It has to be, really, doesn't it? So, most iconic car in Gran Turismo, probably the es Suzuki Escudo. I, I, oh, I don't know. It's, it's it's a hard one. I mean, the Escudo is up there, obviously. Nissan Skyline, because there's been a million of them. Mazda MX-5, it's like often the first car you buy. But I don't know. Suzuki Escudo, is, is, for me, is right up there. Toyota GT1 as well. Castro Tom Supra is like... Castro Tom Supra has got to be right up there, yeah. Thirty laps. I don't know if I'm gaining in this car. I don't know if this car is even much that quicker, really. Oh, no, I was using SS on the last car, wasn't I? This car will be better in the longer term. Okay, I'm slightly slower than the leader. Is this an endurance race? Oh, there was some purple there. Okay, here we go, guys. Rip is... On purple. Still losing to the leader. Yeah, 
Yeah, I might just have to come in, in to see what happens. Just chance it. Interesting challenge, though, this. Ooh, there is no grip. There is no grip. It's the call, though. Do you do inters or do you wet? That's the question. There's no rain tyres. Okay. Mm. Oh yeah, you know, so yeah, it did say at the start you can't, it was only like three sets of tyres, wasn't it? And none of them were wet. You know what, let's just go in and see what happens. Because I think we're losing way too much. No, missed it. Carry on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, God. It's not clear. This is the problem with this game. Like, sometimes you're a bit clueless as to what you need to go into a race with. Yeah, I need. I think I need a different car. You need a four wheel drive, don't you? The R30. This car, this car is too slidey. So I've lost like 10 seconds to the leader. Oh, fucking hell, man. Yeah, the GT... Uh, a bit annoying, but... I suppose, it's, yeah, it's all part of the learning uh, process, isn't it? 30 laps. What did other people use an Evo? Yeah. Yeah, need that's the wrong drive tripe, uh, type. Tripe. Uh, let's see what I've got. Do, 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 do. Have I got an Evo? Tune this up. 4WD. Tune the GTO up. Let's give this a little bit of a tune and um, see what we can get to. Let me just uh, see what the tyres were, the requirement again, just to make sure, 100%. Want to get this right. Uh, sports, hard, medium or soft. Okay, so sports tyres. Okay, right, let's add some, add some power. Put ballast on the Group 4 Supra. Hmm. Good shout. We're gonna go with this. Let's just go, let's just tune this up a bit and um, maybe use medium. Let's, let's go on mediums. A bit better. And want some better brakes. It was six hundred pp or less, wasn't it? Racing brake pads makes it worse. Put them on. We want a turbo chart. Yeah. Medium trophy earned. What's that for? Purchase a turbo supercharger 10 times. Easy. Weight reduction. Stage two. Um, stage three. Yep. It's a little bit random at this point. No, nope, that's too much. Four-wheel drive. It's got the. It's got decent brakes, weight reduction, and it's got the right tires and a bit more power with a turbocharger. Let's run with it. Nitrous. I don't know how much that adds to your um, PP, actually. Interesting to know. I don't think that's really going to help in the rain. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I could have put a new clutch on. Don't forget Western Indians. Yeah, you, can't, you can't you can't use them. You have to use sports tires for this. Right. Oh, uh, let's just go. Let's just do a lap or two and then see. This should be a lot better. Because the AI were doing what, like 103s, 104s in the dry. But um watch it, it won't rain now. It'll do me over. This feels a lot better instantly. It's not even wet yet. Yeah, it feels way quicker. It's much more stable. We're on to a winner here, guys. Evo's the way to go. Thank you, Dominic. Just come here from the pub. Living your best life there, mate. Well, I'm 40 seconds behind as we cross the line here. Let's see what we can do in a lap. There's the clouds. Nothing on the radar yet. Oh, there's something. Got a big old chunky cloud coming in. Thank you, Napoleon, again. God, where... What is that breaking? <laughs> he went right, then he went left. Um, what are you drinking? Um, it's an Estrella. It's a Spanish beer. Okay, we were 40 seconds behind. Now we're 36 behind. So we gained four seconds on that lap. Okay, so that's that's fine. That's good. Because with the GTO, I like wasn't gaining. Let's see how this rain. This, I mean, should be alright. Four wheel drive in the rain. Here we go. Rain's almost there. 33 seconds behind. Just trying to work out which one's the leader on the map. It'd be nice if the leader was a different colour. You could tell. But... Oh, sorry. Right, the wipers are on. The rain has begun. Got to watch that grip meter now. Thank you, Adam. I like the content. Keep it up. Thank you very much, mate. Appreciate that. Right. Still okay. The time being. I need to buy the brake bias thing. Uh, doesn't matter now. Does one part of the circuit get wet first? I guess so. It's quite a small track, so it's not going to make much difference around here, but... I noticed around the Nürburgring, it does... It's not the same, like, around different parts of the track. Thank you, Behimosu. Did I say that right? For becoming a member. Thank you very much, mate. Grip's still okay at the moment. Not too bad.
Oh, look, at the, look at this car with a massive chunky wing on it. It's a Porsche. Whoa, hello. Corvette Stingray having a bit of a nightmare there. Oh, yeah. My fuel. Forgot about that. That, yeah. Should have considered that. Okay, we're going to have to make multiple pit stops at this rate. Hmm. Yeah, the tyres as well. Taking a hammering. Dr. Greg. The lap in the sky. Oh, it's like Hakkinen versus Schumacher. Okay, we didn't use that much fuel on that lap. That's good. Didn't really gain on the leader, but... Might be possible to extend this just to a one-stop. Okay, grip's becoming worse. Watch out for that. Gained a little bit on the on the leader there on that lap, maybe two seconds. I'm just worried about this fuel situation though. Though, how much fuel am I using a lap at the moment? Not too much. A few percent a lap. Good challenge, this. I'm not sure how it's going to go. Got not much grip on the front. Understeering. Save a bit more fuel. I've gained like three seconds on the leader there on that lap. Yeah, you use less fuel when it's raining. That is very true. Use about 7% on that lap. So I could do at least three more laps. I'm going to have to rely on the AI pitting at least once. to the leader below 20 seconds we're definitely gaining but it's just this management of fuel I don't know if I'm getting it right I'm going to have to be pretty uh... okay guys going into the pit lane right, there's fourth why is he queuing behind him like that I do not know oh no Wasn't too bad.
Thank you, uh, Sends Bill and Dominic for becoming a member. Cheers, guys. Okay, that was a slow lap, but. So I hope it's a third. We've only, we're only on lap 10. It's a long way to go, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're approaching wet weather territory now. Well, like wet tyre territory, I mean. Oh, leader just gone with 2% fuel. Okay, that's interesting. 2%. So they're going quite hard. And it looks like the guy in second's going in with 2% as well. So they're going to have to pit twice at that rate. They're going to have to pit twice. Definitely. If they continue like that. Um, let me do one more lap. Might be able to get away with two, but that's a bit of a risk. I'll do, I'll do one. Oh my god. Rip is very bad now. Rotate on the grass. The OG strategy. Yeah, two stop might be more sensible. Although, well, it's possible for me to save fuel and do a one stop, I think, but... Then, yeah, actually, my tyres will be awful, won't they? So, um, how much did they lose there in the pit in the pit lane? Don't know. That's actually not that slow, I don't think. Where does this animation start? Yeah. Uh, medium again. <laughs> the grass strategy. Honestly, I think it kind of works. You go deep. It kind of... You get quite a bit of grip on the grass. Just spin it and then drive off the corner. <laughs> kind of a bit silly, really, but... Thank you, Wallman. What are your thoughts about GT7 AI difficulty? For the most part... Uh, for the most part, it's not that great. It's a little bit inconsistent as well. But you can have a good race, but I think you have to underpower yourself. It depends how good you are compared to the AI. But it's not its not the best AI, really, is it? Right, let's go. Well, I'm in fourth. How many seconds off? Let that settle down. 13 seconds? Okay, let's go back into three. We should be fine here, I would have thought. Is that a wide body? R34. The carbon hood. Love it. Okay, 11 seconds off the lead. Very wet weather now. Treacherous conditions. So surely the leaderboards are going to be a bit random because it depends on what weather you get. We're catching up quite quickly, I think, now. Corvette Stingray, mate. See you later. Oh, where's that AI going? In the pit lane. That's where. Nice and early. Yeah, I think... Yeah, actually, yeah, you can just use it in the pits, can't you? Just fly in. Right, eight seconds off the lead. We're gaining. They must be that one just going through turn one now. Oh, that lighting does look really good. Off the back of that car onto the track just behind it. Shame he's too slow, though. Whoa, hello. That was a bit ropey. Keep it going, son. Yeah, for those asking about inters or wets, um, it's only sports 
um, soft, medium, hard. You can't use racing inters or wets. But to be fair, it's a road car and it's road tyres. So road tyres do have grooves. You can drive in the rain with those. Thank you, Mercury Domini, for the $5. I do appreciate that. Thank you very much. And Kevin Conwell for becoming a member. Okay, so if we can um, just get past the AI here. They're just there. It's those two. Um, I'm saving fuel as well, so we'll have a, a quick second pit stop. That AI has just come out ahead of them, which is good. Okay, these are the leaders. Oh, he's binned it. <laughs> Porsche in the mud. Huge lunge. He's taken the lead. Oh my God. He's done it. Incredible action here. Oh, that might be a bit late. Take the pivot line. Oh, it's beautiful. He's taken the lead. He's driving off. Can anyone stop him? Hopefully not. Oh, okay. This fuel is going down really slow. I might even be able to go to the end, but my tyres will be rubbish. Actually, no. The tyre wear is minimal in the rain. Tyre wear minimal. Fuel is minimal. Let's just keep going. If I have to pit, I have to pit. But the AI pit before me, then I've got the security blanket. I'll just get a buffer. Lunge. Get away from that apex, mate. It's mine. Sensational stuff from the Mitsubishi garage. Thanks to the boys back at base. The fantastic package here today. I don't know where Mitsubishi is based. I don't know which city they're in, but... Wherever the Mitsubishi factory is, you're killing it, guys. You're absolutely killing it. Doing a fantastic job once again. We're simply dominating the race. Oh, look at this. It's just, just masterful. You're under full control. See? Look. Go for the deep line. Cut back. Drive off the corner, mate. I mean, this is just pure mastery. This is dancing are you playing apex legends because you're hitting those apexes like a freaking legend mate dive bombed the mitsubishi it's the toro rosso team orders let him let the red ball through Oh, look at that. Gone deep. Cut back, pivot. Drive off the turn. This rain. Oh, okay. It's a bit patchy now. So it looks like it's... Yeah, it's not as bad as it was five minutes ago. Oh, we continue. What's my fuel? I think it's more important to look at the fuel. quite liking this deep line. I don't know if it's quick, but it feels all right. Make the most of the banking. There we go. 
Yeah, it's getting drier for sure. The rain stopped. The rain stopped. Okay, so it's going to start getting drier now. And yes, as some of you guys were saying in the chat, this is what we saw. They did that time lapse, didn't they, in that trailer, in the State of Play trailer. And it would have been this race, I think. Oh yeah, the fuel. I don't. I think we're going to do another stop anyway, so we should be all right. The AI, I don't think they're going to. They were on two percent on the tenth lap, so I don't think they're particularly fuel saving. Let's go down. A, go down to four. Save a little bit more, just in case. Okay, so actually, look, that place has gone in. We're still on 58% fuel. Now on 10%. Oh, come on. Where's he going? Gather it up there, good sir. Okay, we're... I've got to say, this dynamic weather is really good. This is re like this is cool. Like the way it's drying up here, there's definitely more grip. You see, my lap times are getting quicker. I was doing 116s in the rain, 110 last time. Tash, thank you. I'm streaming tomorrow night. I think I will be. Yeah. Rancho is most seven every day. So that lap was quicker again. As it's getting drier, it's really good. This this weather, honestly, is amazing. They've done it so, they've done it so well. Like the way it looks, the way it feels, it does feel like, it doesn't feel scripted. If it is, it doesn't feel it. Like it does feel quite random, it, like unpredictable. You don't know what's going to happen. It looks really good. The puddles. It's like honestly, they've done such a good job. You Lord Pepsi. Eighteen seconds ahead. One oh six. Getting back towards dry times. Still a bit of moisture though. Thank you, Mark. How's it going, mate? 8k viewers and only 700 likes. I think it's a bit more than that, isn't it? But uh, in terms of the likes, I don't know. But cheers, guys. If you are enjoying, do hit the like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Lots more content on GT7 to come. Lots more. We're barely scratching the surface here. You can be brave here. Go. I quite like this corner. Go. Oh, no, that's not the line. That's not the line. Yeah, I went... At... You do have to pay attention to the damp areas on the track. 4.7k likes. Okay, that's, no, that's cool. That's very good. Yeah, thanks guys for tuning in. Hope you're enjoying it. 8k viewers, near enough. It's very good. It's very good. Right, um... You have to be careful about the damp parts. This is why sometimes it's really hard to overtake because like sometimes there's a single line forms and if you go off it you're back on the wet patch so be really careful it's kind of what lewis did if what was it imola imola last year lewis hamilton went off the line trying to overtake a williams back marker and then he went onto the wet patch and he slid off it's kind of like that Grip here. Fatty, like button has been smashed. Yeah, I hope you really smashed it, mate. Thank you, Fatty. 
Thank you, Tony GC, as well. Oh, really watch where I'm going. Keep it together, mate. I'm going to have to pit again, I think. Because now that it's dry, I won't have enough fuel to the end. But... I'll read these donations at the end. It's a bit hard to read them uh, when I'm racing here, but thank you guys. Right, where are we? We're lap 22. It's quite a good challenge, this. I like this. Right, we'll pit in a minute. I'm 52 seconds ahead. I mean, what are you going to lose for a pit stop? 30, maybe? Put a bit more fuel in. Change the tyres. Actually, I might as well... Because of the tyre wear, I might as well... Oh, yeah, I could feel that as I went off that line there. Stay on the dry patch. What I would like to test is, like... Does the dry bit drive because cars are going over it, or does it, is that bit scripted? So if we kept driving over the puddle, would it dry it out or not? Or is it just the script? I don't know. Quite interesting to know. We could test it out in a multiplayer lobby. If all of us just drove through the puddle, would it dry it? Or does the game just do it on its own? Because I don't know. If it's because of the cars going through it, that's very cool. Right, I might as well pit now. Get these fresh tyres on. Can I yeet it? Let's have a look. Yep. <laughs> Alright. Thank you, El Eluda. And thank you, Tom Lawler. Thank you, Fatty. Thank you, Tony GC. Thank you, Mark. Thank you, Lord Pepsi. Would you say a wheel slash pedals are a must if you are serious about this game? Control is great, but you still can't get a sense of your grip. Um, it's not an absolute 100% must, but if you are... Fill it up and go full mix. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Just attack this last bit. I've got enough of a gap now, so I can lose a couple of seconds filling up. i say if you're going to... If you are really serious and you're going to play this game a lot, like, to get the full experience, get a wheel, yeah. But you don't have to. Okay, right. Let's go back to, like... Uh, just keep an eye on that. Right, how far ahead are we? We'll find out in a sec. It's not 57. It's a bit less than that now. Oh, watch out for the damp patch. 16, 15... 15 seconds ahead, okay, that's alright. I think this Evo is a very good shout. So yeah, anyone trying to do this, um, four wheel drive for sure, because of the rain. And it looks like they pit twice, they don't really save fuel. Thank you, Advanced Gaming. Keep it in the dry patch. There we go. Right, how many laps? Six. Bring this one home. Yeah, this is a really cool challenge. It actually really shows off the game. Oh, no. 
really does show off the game, like the dynamic weather. It is. I, I, I'll say it again, they've done such a good job with it. It's so good. It's going to be really exciting in some of the like, FIA races when you don't really know what's going to happen and it starts raining and people scramble for wet, some don't, some get inters. I think if you get caught out in this torrential rain on slicks, you're, you're done. You have to get that right. You turn into toast. You are literally toast, mate. I'm watching with my brother. He says, thank you for two years of entertainment from Backdoor Galore, not, not from Fatty. Well, I'm happy to provide all the entertainment in the world, mate. Thank you for tuning in. To you and your brother. Okay, we're back into the 102s there. Oh, and the Mexican driver's gone back into the pit lane. That's not very good fuel management. To have to do a third stop so close to the end. Shocking. Shocking effort there, mate. Oh, no, there's no grip. Oh, thanks for that, mate. Going a little bit too wide there. It does actually take quite a while, yeah, for the side of the track to dry out. But this puddle on the right is it's not going. No one wants to go through it. Two laps left. We're almost there. I've got plenty of fuel. New fastest lap. Oh, almost. Hundredth of a second off. I fought 52 seconds ahead. I'm nearly a lap ahead of second. Although, yeah, they've pitted, they've pitted three times. So. Oh, that's another consistent lap. Last lap. Oh, be deep.
Oh, it's actually really fun. I've really enjoyed this. We're getting into the groove of this car. And this track. The right... Oh, no. Uh, just as I say that, I completely outbreak myself. What a fantastic way to end. Spoke way too soon there. And he's done it! He's done it! Oh, yes! Yeah, don't speak too soon, guys, because uh, that's what happens. 3508. Trophy earned. With the length of the USA's Route 66. All right. They done it! All right, we will take that. Nice. Give me the money. Not much money, though. That's a bit... 10,000 credits? Are you kidding me, mate? I spent more on the freaking setup. The car. What do we get? So we go to 86, group 4 car. All right. And all golds. What will it be? It will be the Mac 40. 787 horsepower. Chunky old thing, that, isn't it? The big boy. Da -na 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 -na. Right. All right. We're getting through it. Gone with the wind. Oh, how much have we got to do? So we've still got two sections of the missions left. Um... And then I suppose after that, it's a case of getting through the races in here. Um, in all of these. I've done a lot of them, but again, I don't know how many more there are. That's the question. It doesn't look like there's a huge amount more, but I don't, I don't know what the rate of... I don't know. Let's do, let's do more. Gone with the wind. All right, let's let's start it. Get on with it. Circuit experience. Yeah, I've done all of those as well. I did the, um, all of those earlier in the stream. We we started them yesterday. Finished them today. Or yesterday now. It's gone midnight now. It's one a.m. Where I am. This car, probably better with traction control. It's, I think it's just going to be too hard to like be competitive with this type of car online. You have to tune. You're going to have to tune like this kind of car because it's just so drifty. You have to hold the brake into the corner a little bit more. Keeps it settled. Yeah, it is. Uh, these these cars are just weird. You just have to drive them much more precisely i think holding the brake into the apex does help just settles it down a bit just hold it on for like a little bit longer than you oh okay that's the finish yeah i was a little bit pedestrian there let's try that again So I'll say thank you, Advanced Gaming, um, Fatty as well for the donations, Eluda. Sorry if I missed any. I do thank you all. Oh, mate.
nearly snapped on me there. Jesus Christ. Flash Tiger, thank you so much, mate. A pleasure to have you in the stream as ever. Um, I'll catch you around very soon, mate. Thanks for jumping in. Oh, God's sake, come on. This car, I, I'm, I'm having to hold back because this car is so sketchy, but we'll get it. We will get it. I'll definitely break a bit later into this left hander coming up. didn't know what line he was taking. I wanted to go left and he... Oh. Senivri has become a channel member. Thank you very much. Absolute hero. Thank you, Zach. Transitions for break... Yeah, yeah. Transitions between the pedals have to be very delicate. Have to be... You have to be very considered with your inputs. That's for sure. That's for sure. Yeah. Come on, let's attack it a little bit. Way too deep. Yes. Ooh, that was pretty close. That's quite a good little challenge, that, because that car is not easy. Not an easy car to drive at all, but we've done it. Mm -mm. High speed ring, 30 minutes. Oh, I'm not doing another 30 minutes right now. Slipstream. 248 miles an hour, okay. Michael Egamot became a channel member. How about that? Thank you very much, Michael. All right, here we go. Which side are you going there, mate? Oh, this is wobbly. It's all over the place. Rough CTR3, look at that thing. Legendary car. Oh, there's a sixth gear. What am I doing? Okay, I'll, I'll try shifting up next time. That, that might help, mine it? Two hundred forty-eight. The Bugatti Veyron's the best car in. Oh, oh where's he going? Best car in the game, guys. Did you know that? Car so wobbly. Go on, that's it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Okay, that was good. Done it. Mm -hmm. What is next? Drag race. Okay. What should we go with? Surely with these rally cars will be quick off the line. I'm going to try this car. This might be a really weird choice. I don't know what I'm up against either. Is it the Viper? 
Yeah. Oh, what do I did then? Okay. Yeah. Right, he's gonna come back at me though. He punted me off. Okay, this car is not gonna be quick enough. <laughs> uh, got a good, really good launch, but <laughs> that guy ran me off. He should be disqualified. Come on, you all saw that. You all saw that. Shameful. Honestly. That guy should be ashamed of himself. <sighs> Let's give this a go. Can't believe he just punted me off. Tried to punt me off. Should be banned. All right, R33. Should have a good launch. Whoa. Okay. All right. <laughs> Oh, um, yeah, we're gonna have to do some work here, I think. That was not... That Viper was fast. Okay, uh... Oof, Jesus. Carandon137, watching with my son. Shout out to Michael. Thank you very much, man. Anonymous with a 420 as well. <sighs> Always good to hear you all tuning in with your family. Love that. Let's try this. That Viper, I mean, once I got going, that was ballistic. Have you got a Group 1 car yet? I don't think I have. <laughs> okay, no, not this car. It reminds me of that scene in, um, is it Too Fast, Too Furious? When, like, they rev the car. It's like, ream, ream, ream. And then there's that guy in the muscle car. Revs the engine. The car's, like, twisted. It's like, American muscle. Broken. Classic scene, mate. American muscle. Back. Phil, late night sour Skittles fund increase. I'm going to have, uh, like, a whole pallet full of these aren't I Carrera GT oh man by the tomahawk I'm gonna come back here yeah just do a bit of seal clubbing with the tomahawk I'll show this dodge viper who's, who's boss yeah Hannah Scott thank you for becoming a member thank you very much yeah I don't have any group one cars Best car I have is this, but that was slidey. Mac 40. Mac 40. That would be an absolute. Let's let's just try it. This this will be the worst drag car of all time. Okay, right, let's do, let's do it properly. God, that's so bad. Only two seconds off, only three and a half seconds off. Yeah, uh, that's not the car to use. Wait, what do, pe what do people use? SRT Tomahawk, yeah. R32, R32, R33. Okay, R33 does work. Dude, I nearly had you. Doesn't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. Winnings winning. People did do in the 86 rally car. Lewis Bentley in the 86 rally car. Oh, the Porsche Taycan. That's a good shout. Ashley Ponsford has become a member as well. Wanton one tap for the donation as well. Thank you. Thank you. The Porsche Taycan. That is a solid little shout there. Let's, uh, 
whip out the electric motor. Where is my Taycan? Samba bus. Wait. I sh I'm sure my Taycan is white. Why am I not seeing it? Right, let me do I'm I'm obviously blind, you're all screaming at me right now. It's right there, it's right there. Wait, I don't have a tight I thought I did. I thought I did have one. I don't actually have one. I could just buy it. I I swear I had that car. Not compliant. Manual oh yeah, manual transmission only. Yeah, sorry. I do have one, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, it makes sense. I'm just being very stupid, obviously. Okay. Um, hmm. This is a this is a fun challenge, just trying to find the right car. I, I think I'm gonna have to tune one, aren't I? Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white visor. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Thank you. Keep that great channel going. Greeting, German Canadian. We truly do have a global audience. It's incredible to see. Alpine VGT. This could just be the random car that you need. This could be it. This is it. Tires. Yeah, actually. Better tires. It's a good shout. Make a mini with a jet engine. Well. Max out the R33. Yeah, I think that's the shout, isn't it? An R33, R32. So I've been watching some people do the online race and um, the current Deep Forest race and, oh, it's not loading. And um, the R32s are ridiculous off the line. They do have a launch on them. Okay, I don't know why this is not loading. Supra. Yeah, Supra would surely be quick. The 97 Supra. And by NOS. Actually, that's a good point, because I, don't, I haven't used NOS yet in this game. Tom Jenkins. Swale for life. Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Aaron. Hey, Steve, just want to let you know that you've been the main reason I got back into sim racing, and it's helped me to stop smoking and drinking. All love. Wow, okay. That's quite something. I'm saving lives now. Uh, we're going to have to close the game and go back in, I think. Yeah, let's go back in. Should we spend £100 on microtransactions? Should we just spend all, all the money I have, I'll just buy on uh, microtransactions. Because uh, that's just all I want in life, really. I don't need money in real life, I need money in the game. That's what we've been working towards, guys. That's, uh, that's, uh, that's my destiny. Just to be really rich on Gran Turismo 7. Alpha 155. Uh, um, I'm going to get the R32, I think. I want to make a... I've got the R33. Let me just double check if I've got the R32. Uh... Mitsubishi... R33, R32, I have. Okay. I have it. Let's make a beast out of this thing. Uh, nitrous, yes, please. Thank you. Uh, generic Porsche with a training wheel on it. Bro really spun on a straight. You saw it, mate. Sport soft. Did it, there was no regulation for tyres, was there? Racing softs. Get all of the weight reductions on there. We're going all out. I don't care how much this costs. I'm doing it. That Viper is going down. Yeah, nitrous is a bit of a joke, but I don't care right now, you know? I don't care right now. Wait, there wasn't... No, there was no regulation, was there? 
Henry Gomez, 52-year-old man living vicariously through you. <laughs> Love to hear it, man. Is it worth... Wait, sports air filter. There's not a different air filter, is there? No. Okay. Uh, Lucas, thank you for the donation as well. Suspension brakes don't need bore up. Yeah, makes it better. Sport clutch, flywheel, yeah. Power restriction, no. Get a jet engine, racing air filter, yeah. I'm just going to buy like everything right now, even though it's kind of pointless. Spending all my hard-earned money. Anti-lag system. Greatly improved throttle response in turbocharged cars. Wait, um, which low-end, low RPM turbocharger? What do you reckon would be best, low or medium? Probably not a high. I'm just trying to think which one would be best. I tend to play it safe with a medium, but... High, high, okay. I don't really know. Racing air filter, medium high, medium high. Wait, what is that? 655, 660. Everyone's saying high and medium. Let's go, let's go high. We're going high. Sports intercooler. Yeah, put it on there, mate. Slight improvement. Thank you, uh, Mr. Nolan. Would you rather have taste buds on the palm of your hands or the soles of your feet? The hell? Palm of your hands, I guess. Weird question, though. Racing into cooler. Yeah. Racing air filter. Yeah. Racing silencer. Yeah. If we don't win this, like, I'm just going to go to bed because, like, this ain't good enough. We're, we're just. How much have I spent on this car? Like 300 grand? <laughs> this is this is getting silly now. This is getting silly. It's, get, it's getting better. We're, we're, we're doing it. And I need to map a button for new engine. I need to do that. I need to map a button Get the racing brake disc. We don't need to brake. We don't need to brake. Uh, right, let me map a button to uh, the NOS. Get rid of the handbrake. Uh, right, where's nitrous? There we go. I don't know which button that actually is on the wheel. It's a button, okay. Right, let's give this a go. We don't need brakes. Like it's special stage route X. You've got the whole oval to slow down. It's all good. Let's see if this. Let's see if this is good enough. If it's not, then uh, I might as well just give up. Go home. Right, bring it on, stupid Viper man. <laughs> right. Okay. Right. Let's do it properly. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, we have to. I have, have to tune it. That was. Uh, that was. Oh, I didn't use NOS either, did I? Wait, I didn't use NOS. Didn't use NOS. Let me go back. Let me use NOS. Let me see, let me see the difference. I need to make sure I know what button is. Oh, where's the meter for NOS? Oh, there. Wait, which button is it? Wait, why is it not going down? Oh, that button. Okay. Right, I know the button now. I know the button now. 
stop on. Oh. <laughs> Bit closer, but uh, let's try. I, I don't think I'll beat him, but let's try and get a little bit quicker. Ge gear ratios, yeah. Yeah, may maybe. Is there a setting for the NOS? Um, car settings. Can you change the nitrous oxide? Um, here we go. Right, maximum output because it wasn't going, it wasn't getting used anywhere near quick enough. Oh, did I, did I change that? Yeah. All right. So it was going down way too slow. I need more power. We're quicker, I think, but yeah, it, it, it seems like the gear shifts aren't good enough. Have I? Let me just check. I've definitely got the um, best clutch and the anti lag is off. Oh wait, let me let me just double check the transmission quickly. Anti lag system on. Yeah, well, I'll, ch I'll change that in a sec. Let me just. Let me just, uh, clutch and flywheel, let's, I'm going to buy this so we can, if we need to tweak it, we can, um, oh my God, I've spent so much on this car. Oh, no, no, don't care. Uh, Oh, that's what I wanted to buy, isn't it? Uh, we'll leave it now. Increased body rigidity. Mm. Oh, racing crankshaft. Will that make it quicker? One sec, sorry. No. Oh, why do I keep doing that? It's a point. Does the suspend... Where's that suspension setting? Fully customizable suspension. Felipe, baby, stay cool. We're bringing you the white fire. Stay cool. We're in a good position. Uh, thank you, Lucas, and thank you, Mr. SR, and Coffee, Coffee Snorter, and Zach, and Mr. Nolan. Cheers, guys. Let me get my controller here. Uh, where are we? Gone with the wind. I kind of just want to beat him in this car now. Even if it's like not right. Um, anti lag. All right. On high RPM. All right. Let's let's just try the anti lag and let's see if that. Um... See what that does. Maybe, yeah, do first get into second, then use the nitrous. <laughs> okay, that was a little bit. Right, try again. Yes, come on! Get in there, Lewis. <laughs> Oh, we done it. Suck on that, mate. Suck on that, Viper. Easy game. No no sweat, mate. I didn't just spend 400 grand trying to beat you. I didn't. That didn't happen. That's a stock car right there. And just pure talent. I'm just a really good driver. I'm just really good at driving and it's a stock car and I didn't pump loads of money pointlessly into that.
That was the worst use of credits you've ever seen. Oh, it's one of these again. The fuel saving challenges, all right. And a they run around the Nordschleifer. Oh my God, that went down so quick. Five point five miles. Oh my god, how far is that? This car really does have good rolling resistance. Trying to think where the hills are. Keep it nice and smooth there, mate. Oh, there's a seventh gear, isn't there? Good shout, chat. We're going to roll down this hill. There is a, an uphill on the other end of it, but. Surely a car can't roll this far like this. Seems a bit much. Now, will I get up this hill? Do I need a little bit? No, it might be all right. It might be all right. Keep going, keep going. That's it. That's it. Oh my god, it's so slow. How much uphill is there? There's a bit more uphill here. Oh my goodness. Where's five miles going to be? Like... I want to think where on the track that is. Okay. This is incredible gameplay. This is this is the content you you logged onto YouTube and you wanted to watch this. You didn't know that you wanted to watch this. And now that you're here, you're like, actually, I don't need to be anywhere else. This is all you need. Okay, I might have gone a little bit quick there. Hopefully this corner is flat. 60 miles an hour in a Veyron. Don't want to break. Need to carry as much speed as possible. Nice and smooth. Oh, oh the throttle, yeah. Oh, yeah, that was on. That was on a tiny bit there. truly riveting gameplay this is really cool it's a cool challenge i quite like it well we're going to gain enough 80 miles an hour down here look at that we're racking up the mileage you'll love to see it come on keep going that's it all right i need to be smooth through here oh power's coming back on again What is going on? Why is that? Why is that stuck on a tiny bit? Maybe this is helping me. I don't know. This is like perfect throttle control. Just keep it there. I don't know why it's doing that. But it seems to be working. Lord Jesus, the earth is on the ray run. Classic quote from a was it a Horizon 4 video? Alright, well um was the is it the controller? No. My controller is plugged in, but it's not. 
Is this hindering me? I don't know if it is. I think this is like actually giving me perfect like I'm going pretty far pretty quickly like this. Oh, well, it's back off again. There's that massive uphill bit in a bit, isn't there? Thank you, Ethan Blaine. Cheers, man. I'm going to have to break for this a little bit. Right, that's enough. Yep. Well, the power's back on again. <laughs> By 5.5 miles. Then there's that long uphill section before the carousel. That's going to be impossible. Sophie line. Now what do we do? We're going to have to accelerate a bit. I don't know what the best way is to do this. Seventh gear. Still going to go up. Just no power. I'll floor it. Okay, just see where we can get to. I don't know what the top uh, on my friends list was. I think it was 6.6 .6 or something. Oh, we've got gold, easy, but this bit goes on forever, this uphill. It's going to be pretty hard, but okay, that's, I don't know. I don't know how good that was. Okay, lots of my friends got I was just about not... I was 11th. So yeah, so a lot of them stopped on that hill somewhere. Six point seven nine. Where would that be? That would probably be towards the carousel. Interesting. Interesting challenge. Very interesting polyphony. <sighs> yeah, it's definitely all about patience, that challenge, for sure. Spa, F1 car in the rain. Okay, right. Watch me die a thousand times. Can't see anything. Give me the wide divisor. Otherwise, I cannot see anything. Oh my goodness. I need a I need a white visor. Felipe baby, stay cool, we're in a good position, okay? Jesus Christ. Chase cam might be an advantage here.
puddle. Where's the finish? I don't know where the finish is. I don't know how patient I can be. It's probably going to be up on this straight, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. I thought it might be there. And am going to have to be a bit more aggressive. Get one pass before Rivage. Get one before Puon. Alright, there we go. Oh my god, it's so much clearer. Night and day difference. That's a good challenge, that. That is a good little challenge. That is so hard to see when you're behind him. So hard. <laughs> right, one lap magic. Monza. All right. Bring it on. Go to bed, yeah. Maybe. It's half one now. 25 seconds. I'll go to bed in a bit. Maybe I need to start streaming later. Got a good 8,000 viewers overnight. It's pretty good. I think, I think it's a bit easier for the Americans to tune in, you know. Okay, this might be tricky. Is this... The chicane is there, yeah. God. Violent fishtailing. I got caught out by when he was breaking there. Oh my god. 8pm in New York. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's a bit more of a reasonable time. Although it is a Saturday in America now. Sunday now in Europe. Okay, you need to break in a straight line. If you turn when you break, you're going into the wall. <coughs> Put one TCS on. Yeah, it does help for the launch. <clears throat> oh my god. This guy's it's on the ragged edge. Oh, 
that's deep. Keep it on, keep it on. Just about. Ferrari F50, what a car. Oh, which size are you going? Mm, a bit late. I might be able to drag past the leader to the line, but we'll see. It's going to be close. No, it won't be. A bit too deep. No, it'll be fine. It's fine. We're good. Ooh, this car is sketchy. <sighs> All right. What's the? Is this the last one? We haven't. There was the thirty-minute race which we skipped. Well, we will we'll get that another time. Drift mission. Dodge Viper. All right. Seven and a half thousand. All right. This is my horrific attempt at drifting. Okay. That's a solid basis from which you can work from. The bodge. The vodge diaper. Attack it with speed. Alright, this can be quite tricky. We'll get there. We'll get there. Don't you worry. Okay, that was awful. Yeah, I do need a handbrake. This is my weakness. Yeah, I'm not a good drifter at all. Come on. Oh, that's nowhere near enough. Oh. It was a nice little drift, but... No. Oh. If I did that drift in one go, not two goes, I would have got that. Change the rim, yeah. Circular SCSL rim would be a lot better for this. Too much. Oh, yeah, go a little slower. I need to get two thousand, two and a half thousand first bit, I think. No, God. Oh, man. a weird car yeah a round wheel would definitely help but wait I, want, I, want, I think I can do it there we go attack it with speed uh, oh 
So if I get two and a half thousand, I need five thousand on the second drift. What if I just want to do a reverse drift? Come on. I keep throttling into it. Ooh, that was a good second drift. Okay, just string it together now, come on. Just string them both together, it's, it's easy, mate, come on. Okay, well, it's hard doing it at speed because then you don't have much time to react coming off the drift. Been streaming for um nearly six hours nearly six hours mate it's a long time God, what did everyone else get on this? How long did eight and a half thousand? Key got eight thousand. Yeah, I'll try to go. Let me go a little bit slower. Let me go slower. That's too fast. Thank you, Jack. Okay, that was a good second drift. The first one, first one didn't really work. It's not going to be enough. Oh, man. Third person. It's just going to be really hard to get used to third person so quickly. Whoa. Nice. Oh, I can't get used to that. Turn TCS off. It is off, pretty sure. Yeah, it's not even... It's not on. Uh, I can't be asked with this. I'm done. I'll do it another time. Because it is late, 
nearly 2 a.m. Um, how many, uh, how many on this last bit? So I've done the first one. Le Mans 24 minutes, cone challenge, drag race, the pass, drift, one lap magic, and another race. How long is this race? I, just, I don't, I'm not going to do it. I just want to know how long it is. 20 minutes. Hmm, okay. So we've got quite a lot of progress here. Um, done most of the missions. That's probably a few more hours on there to do. License is all done. World circuits. Um, yeah, getting through it. We are getting through it. How long have I spent on this game now, on this account? 49 hours. Driven for 20. That is a fair old chunk. Fair old chunk of time. Yeah, it's too late for me. I'm tired now. It's nearly 2 a.m. I've been streaming for six hours. It's been a long day. Um, I am going to call it a night there, I think. It's been a really good stream, actually. Um, we've got through a lot. We've got through a lot. Thank you to all the viewers all the donators of course all new members um if you're new to the channel get yourself subscribed get yourself subscribed there's going to be loads more to come so it's been it's been really fun it's been really fun i hope you've all enjoyed it i've really enjoyed it uh let me uh, get some good old background song on where is it here it is All right, everyone, it's uh, been a pleasure. I will catch you. I'll probably be on again tomorrow streaming. So same sort of time tomorrow night. So we can finish off the missions, get those finished, and then we can get onto the world circuits, finish those as well. But um, yeah, it's been really good. I've enjoyed this one. I hope you have too. Um, finish those as well. Oh, I can hear myself. Yeah, it's been fun, everyone. Uh, have a great rest of your weekend. Hopefully you can tune in again tomorrow. We'll, we'll continue again. And uh, yeah, it's been fun. I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.